of mortals, bound by fate's golden strands. with darkness. But don't cut it short. Tell us the whole story. Tell us about hope. Okay, gamers, dude, happy Friday. Happy Friday. Where's this man at? There we go. Um, I think we're going to start with Atlantis today. We do Atlantis and Ragnarok, and hopefully, hopefully I have enough time uh, to do Act 1 Epic. That would be epic, obviously. Um, big grind today, boys. I am excited. I am excited. Hello! Ho. What a great day! Uh, yeah, let's let's start with Atlantis. Hello, Mop. Hello, Osboss. Happy Friday. What's up, gamers? Happy Friday! Yeehaw! Yeehaw! Um, no gold. Oof, no gold. Bummer dudes. Hello, ho. what a great day. Hello, Wendigo. Hello, Asadir. Until I go to bed, it's legally Thursday. Hello. Uh, yeah, I can agree to that. Until, until it, um, until you close your eyes for longer than. Uh, uh, you know, a blink. 
Khaleesi, four billion months. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. Thank you very much. This looks nice. Oh yeah, good old Atlantis. We love Atlantis. Hello there. Hello there. Anata is the best. Tomorrow, I tomorrow, 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 tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Tomorrow. <laughs> okay, boys. Big Atlantis farm. Uh, do we do all the side quests? I I threaten to do them every time. Yes. We could we could do them all. That's no problem. Oh, I forgot we got bow. This bow is way better. This bow is way better. Five hundred points of damage. Wait, I thought we were hitting. Maybe they have they have, they have more fizzres. That's for sure. Weird. Fizzres in Atlantis. What? Who knew? Hello. Bezcos for also four billion months. Get blasted. Get blasted. Thank you, sir. Okay, Carl, salute. <laughs> Get blasted. 65 streak also. Holy smokes. Yeehaw. Uh, hello, hello, Mr. Brick. That's like asking, is, is Tom Cruise a Scientologist? The answer is always yes. Well, I mean, uh, well, is that true? I mean, like, was he was he a Scientologist when he was a baby? Huh. Hmm. Interesting. I didn't know that. I actually, 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 actually. Actually. I was <laughs> actually. Okay, boys. Cave complete. Excellent. Moving on. Yo, we can we can actually get between Atlantis and Ragnarok. Hello. What a great day. We can get some juicy power and then listen, later today, holy smokes. Later today. We do uh epic. Oh my gosh. Epic difficulty OP. I love it. Can't wait. And we have some deja vu. We died to the tyrant. <laughs> Who's your epic mama? <laughs> mama? Who's your epic mama? You are my epic mama. Who's your epic mama? <laughs> Dude, I, I love that that command. Dude, his mic is just like, I don't know. It's like muffled. It's perfect. Glorious. Your epic mama? Glorious. It's all about the money. Here we are, level twelve. I blew the horn. Let's see, he's a turkey. He's a turkey. I killed some unholy bacon. Unholy bacon. All right. 
Uh, I, there's a there's a side side cave that has an item that I will forget. Don't let me forget. Don't let me forget. Um, let's see who do we got. Hello, Gonish. Hello, Indingo. Hello, Waffle. Hello, gamers. Happy Friday. Yeehaw. Yeehaw. Big Friday. Yo, Big Friday gamers. Big Friday gamers. Excellent. Excellent. We are doing it. We are doing it. Wow. Uh, Sork Staff. Look at that. Sork Staff. 15% LE damage uh, and 11% attack speed. Going to Amsterdam. Do I use any mods? No. Mods. I have in the past. I've played mods. Zero mods right now, though. Uh, I would like to play. I would like to play through Soul Bazaar soon. Soon TM, of course. Always soon TM. I have not played Soul Vizier in a long time. Hello, Susie. Happy Friday. Oh, monsters. I am here to kill you. Steal your loot. Take your XP. Uh, we need to go in here. In here's where the puzzle box is. Oh no, it's different. It's a different tomb. Nope, different tomb. Hello! What a great day! What a great day! Uh, hello, Aphrodite. Oh no, it is this one. It is this one. We got the right one. Get the puzzle box. Get the puzzle box. Okay, I take it back. It is not this one. <laughs> you can't carry anymore. Uh, can't carry anymore. Time to sell. Yo, we need big gold. I need to gamble all my gold away. P uh, pay my gambling debts. Well, first I gotta rack up my gambling debts. Hmm. Fine weapons. Look at them. The best. <laughs> he says, hmm. <laughs> okay. Let's see. We are good. Wow. Stout unconstrained. Nice. 50 stream streaker. Heesh. Uh, hello, Mookster. Happy Friday. Yeehaw. Yeehaw. Jesus guide you. Magical trinkets and wonders <laughs> Jesus from guide all you. over the known world. Oh, Tinkerer Tinker ring. Purple. Yes, right here. Tinkerer ring. Blessed be Metal Cart. Uh, my path is blocked. My path is blocked. Ow. Sheesh. That guy hurts.
Nice, a Monkey King's trickery. Time to kill some bacons. Look at these unholy bacons. Unholy bacons. Yo, we could we could get uh, ancient Tartesian bow, or or we could get a bow that could the, what's the coral reef bow or Grimfang bow. It actually, could be an upgrade. Could be an upgrade with very specific affixes. Hello, double A. Hello, gamer. Happy Friday! Uh, here, let's go back here. Oh, I, I went the wrong way. Wait, 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 wait. We, we, did, we did miss a tomb. I do have to go back. I do have to go back. Hold on. And back we go. Hold on. Please hold. Time out. Time out. Uh, Mookster. 50 stream streaker. Holy smokes. Yo, you guys, you guys are long, long time. Long time chatters, first time viewers, holy smokes. Holy smokes. Oh, Necropolis gown. Do you guys, do you guys remember, uh, I think I farmed this. I farmed this for a long time. Like three, three characters ago and not a single one of them dropped. And now when you're not playing the character that you need it on, you just get it. Just get it. Uh, what's very big about this is the implicit is flat energy regen and plus to, uh, to spirit. Um, yeah. Just, just get energy. Hello, minimal. Happy Friday. Need more energy. Just get energy. Yeehaw. Yeehaw. All right, here's the impossible puzzle, puzzle box. This box is so impossible. Oh no, sculpture. The box is uh, in Galos, the next town. All right, now we can move on, boys. Your epic mama. <laughs> I know who my mama is. It'd be nice if there's more bank space. Uh, if you are on PC, if you and and Twitch, if you do exclamation point TQ, there's a link to a third-party tool called Titan Quest Vault TQ Vault. Uh, it's not in game, but it's in, uh, um, outside of game. Unlimited storage, basically. But alas, in game space would be nice too. I will, I will say this though. There was, there was, uh, a time in my life when I played Titan Quest and there was no in game caravan. 
Yep. Yep. I remember. Everything was stored on mules. I still know people that um, do the mule system. You know, you create a, either an accomplished hero or a legendary hero. Just transfer everything over. It is the way. It is the way. Oh, item. Boots. Harmony. Not boots. Twenty kills, no boots. Oh man, what are you farming for? Athena's boots or something? Here's what you gotta say out loud. Here, you, you gotta say now. I'm looking for, uh, you know, some shield, so that you reverse psychology the game. Then the game gives you the other thing you were looking for. That's what you have to do. It works every time, uh, sometimes. <laughs> Alfina. <laughs> Good old Alfina. <laughs> Did you say that on purpose? That's funny. <laughs> uh, I okay, boys. We got we got big boss coming up. Big spoopy boss. Big spoopy boss. All right, blow the horn. Blow the horn. <laughs> We're doing the dam. We're doing the dam. Easy. Easy. Wow. Shield of Anguish. It's trash. Although, this actually looks cool. Big giant, uh, like, blue, like, green jelly jam donut in the middle. <laughs> and, uh, and, it, and, uh, it does have, it does have some bit res on it. That is pretty good. I'm a winner. Back to town, boys. Susie's on the 50 streaker, too. Wow, big streak. Sheesh. Okay, we got other quests to turn in. About the money. <laughs> Welcome back. Let's flex. Let's let's flex. Let's let's flex. Let's let's flex. Let's flex. Let's flex. Hiram. Hiram is safe. Another tomorrow. Tomorrow. I. We did it. We did it. We did it. Tomorrow. Look at them. <laughs> Look at them. He's escaped you. Okay, I have one thing to do. Oh, let's go back to roads. I, I forgot to remove a point yesterday in takedown. Everything done can be I'm on not using takedown. Destiny teach you greatness. And we that means we can one point. What is a magical one point? 
Um, I do not know. Probably more volley. More volley. A volcanic orb. No, that's a trash. That, that's that's a trash. That's a trash skill. Volcanic orb soon. You return. <laughs> I return. What do you call me? Monster lure. What, what? What is this? Your build? What is this? Your build? You think? What, you think this is your build? You see? You see your name on here somewhere? Like soon, soon, or Quinn TM soon. Yeah, no. Uh, well, the other one actually, the uh, the other, one. Uh, the other soon. The other soon. Put the eye of Sauron on the monsters and then murder. And use your your Jedi powers from uh, Gryffindor. Hey. You're hey. real, aren't you? Hey! I am sorry. Last night I made camp in a nearby cave and I may have smoked a bit too much. He smoked a bit too much. He got phantoms. he got crazy. Again, he went Kerpaloo crazy. Gotta go get his crack pipe. Uh, how long did it get take me to get Bramble? Uh well. It was funny because yesterday I said if I get Mabuti's spear, I will switch. But I'm not gonna farm for it. And I said, if I get Bramble Bow, I'm gonna switch, but I'm not gonna farm for it. And I got both of them without farming on the first kind of clear. <laughs> it's pretty stupid. <laughs> yeah, it's like, I almost, almost needed to check my computer for vi uh, Virus Battle Pass. It happened live, live on stream. That's one of those things that you just you almost don't believe. But I was there. Okay, we got the crack pipe. And we got to level up. Uh, okay. Oops, I did not mean to hit that button. Oh, actually, I did. Yeah. No, this works out. This is good. He goes, hey! Hey! Ah, uh, you got my... Hey! You! <laughs> hey! Alright, boys. Let's kill some... Some... Uh, some fruit flies. And some demons. Some mud people. Hello, mud men. Where are the mud ladies? That's what I'm interested in. Excellent damage.
<laughs> my build was completed, remember? <laughs> Waffle. Dude, I'm sorry, man. Hopefully you don't care too much. <laughs> I deleted somebody else's too, and I can't remember. Maybe Kaz's? It's an accident. I don't know how to scream. I'm new to all this. Hello, Oli. What bow? I use um, I use Bramble Bow. I'm using the Bramble Bow. It rolled Energy Leech and Strength. Okay. Okay. Have to go in this cave. This is where the puzzle box is. Don't miss the puzzle box. The Neanderthals are big. Uh, I pulled too many. I pulled too many. Here's the puzzle box. Hello, Baja Blast. Welcome in. Happy Friday. Hello, gamer. Hello, YouTube. Hello, Twitch. How are you, my friends? Big damage. Just blow the horn. Hail, mighty hero. <laughs> Hello, Zykanol. Happy Friday. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! Nice. Mentors. Mentors of Tinkerer. Wait, where'd I go? This is actually Pog. Um, for a lot of builds because of the energy. Like, if you're going to play with curses, you have uh, reserved energy. So getting more, more energy is always good. And it's a Tinkerer. Hello, XYD. Need more energy. Uh, you you vowed never to die with your thane, so I retired my conqueror and moved gear to them. Wow, wow, we woe. Wow, wow, we woe. Need more energy. I don't like to brag, but I think my Thane is the best I've done so far. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeehaw. Just keep grinding. <laughs> Just keep grinding. Kill more monsters. More monsters. Wow. Reef Guard's barrier. Actually, the Reef Guard stuff is is interesting. But you have to get really good affixes to roll on them. Huh? Reef Guard grieves. <laughs> huh? <laughs> huh? Just get them. I think if you got Tinkerer affix on Reef Guards, they'd be really good. 
But I'm I'm always always more interested in the gold thing stuff. Always. The weapons, the armor, all of it. It's just better. It's just better. Excellent damage. Um, I have 80k points, so my first request is on the way. Hell yeah. We, uh, just so you know, just so you know, this goes to everyone. I have like seven builds in the queue. Seven builds. At least. <laughs> just so you guys know. Uh, what difficulty do you need to be need to be in for eternal embers? Uh, it's legendary only You can create a new character Called a legendary hero. It starts you at level 70 And you have most most you have all the DLC unlocked that way and it gives you a starter set of gear Um or if you grind from level 40 or level 1 all the way through the chapters, once you get uh, through Act 4, once you finish Act 4, you can go to Act 5. You could do Atlantis or you could do Eternal Embers. They, they don't, you know, as long as you beat Act 4, you can go uh, straight to Eternal Embers. But it's legendary only. I have plus five to skills. Time to swap SBCs. Nice. What's a good suffix slash uh, affix for arm piece besides griffin or tinkerer? Unless there isn't one. Well, there's a ton. If you want to look at affixes, this is what I recommend doing. Just go over here to the database. Um, just go over to the database and then it, you'll browse your prefixes. Right, just kind of scroll and just just look at some of these see which ones you want make sure they can drop on uh, Arm pieces, right? So like brutal. This is just weapons only just kind of browse through here See which one same thing with suffixes. They're all listed here You know just just browse and Maybe try to target farm one That's what I recommend doing it'll get you really familiar with uh how many affixes are in the game and you'll start to memorize them more. But, I mean, if you want recommendations, there's nothing wrong with trying to get really good um, resistances on there. You know, cleansing or, you know, poison res or uh, impenetrable. A lot of people try to target farm a weightless, you know, minus requirements on Stonebinder's Cuffs because that's actually pretty big. Um, but the, the, the Stonebinder's Cuffs, unless it's on Legendary, I kind of just accept what I get, right? Because... Um, 
because the legendaries, the legendary ones are the the really powerful one, and so that's the one you want to farm for a really nice, you know, really nice combo. If if you got the time, you know, if, if you're if you're into that, you know, if you're gonna stick with that character for a very long time, if you're actually gonna try to hit 85, you might as well farm for a good pair of stone binders on legendary. Your inventory is full. But then also, if you're playing with curses, affixes matter all the time. Another one. Another one. Hmm. <clears throat> I think we have a completed torture soul. I have more. He Which has more. Are these items from? Yeah. And unlucky. We did not get the uh we did not get the bonus I wanted. Okay, oh, we get we did get a hydrodon hide. That's nice. 20 percent less damage from beasts. Big. And we got monkey. Is that our only monkey? No, we have two monkeys. Nice. Nice. Two monkeys. Okay. Knock on wood. Knock on wood. I almost ruined myself with these prices. Another <laughs> another mentor's tinkerer. We can afford it. Let's get it. Look at that. Mentor's tinkerer. Pretty nice. Blessed be metal cards. What a curious What a curious device. Who's your epic mama? <laughs> Damn Naomi, what what the it's hell? Dead, isn't it? You're here early. Hello, Naomi. Happy Friday. Who's your epic mama? Who's your epic mama? <laughs> oh, damn. Who's your epic mama? Look at this. Dreadful trident. Dreadful prefix on weapons are awesome because it's the flat damage. Flat cold, flat vit, flat bleed. How dreadful. It's epic week. It's early weekend. Nice. Log in. Yeah, happy happy Friday. Man. Big gamers. Time to big game. Minus requirements. That's pretty good. You want light of tinkerer for this guy. Discharge activated upon taking damage. Let's see if we can get it to proc here. Hello, -ho. what a great day. Here it is up here. You'll see it. I think it already procked once. There it is. There it is. Uh, hello, Extreme. I, my mod man manager is crashing. Hello, Cow. 
Happy Friday, gamers! What is going on? Blow the horn. <laughs> First episode of Fallout is good. Fun, fun, fun. Not sure if I should keep going. Yo, Naomi. Always give up, always surrender. That's my motto. Stranger, spin. Thank you for help. I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait for her answer. That is my motto. Here, t this is this is how you deliver the letter fastest. Take the letter over here, and you just throw it into the water. It will get there when it gets there. Make no mistake, stranger. If you want any of the goods from our storehouse, you need to pay for them. You need to pay for your tinkerer ring. Nice. Oh, oh my, oh my, oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Murderous of the Tinkerer. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Binge. Uh, <laughs> always refund. Um, makes me want to reinstall New Vegas. Do it. I uh, we I think we buy this. This is like, this is like dirt cheap too. Under 800k gold. Here, let's let's see if we can set this up. So without a charm, it's 415 points of damage. We can put, we could put two charms on it, right? So we could put uh, something we don't have completed, which is Art uh, Artemis's bowstring and uh, Valor of Achilles. And just pog it out of my mind. So the th the thing about that is, I don't think I have either one of those completed. Right. And if I did, it would be an upgrade. First chest is free. Let's see. Yeah, Artemis' str string. I, I still only have two out of t uh, three. And then there's no way I have another Valor of Achilles. But we could take... We could take um, Bramble Bow's Valor of Achilles. That would be okay. So the question becomes, do we go back to Act 1? Just for a bowstring? I think we do. Yeah, I think we do. Like, why not? It's Friday. It's time to farm. It's time to farm. Um, the problem... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's go back to Act 1. What's the big deal? Back to Athens, boys. <laughs> Back to Athens. Uh, I went softcore after BS deaths. Uh oh. Uh oh. No more dying. We salute the fallen here, boys. We salute the fallen. All right, Pete soldiers. Spin the wheel. Go next. All right. What are the chances I get a bowstring on the first kill?
Golden Fleece. Okay. It's not bad. I'm not upset. It's just not what I want. We go next, boys. Always go next. Oh, we have Violent Winds. Oh. Violent winds. Your game crashed again. Time to refund somebody else's mods. Time to refund the mods. How big was the download, Nami? It was an 11 gig update to a 90 gig, like to a 70 gig file or, you know, set of files. Holy smokes. <laughs> That's crazy. Prometheus Flame. Yeah, that's nuts. And 90 gigabytes of crash. <laughs> Don't you love it? <laughs> 90 gigabytes of crash. Where are my charms? Need bowstring. Need bowstring. We need bowstring. We're supposed to have 50 mile an hour winds, boys. I had an outdoor event. Well, semi outdoor event to, to film this evening. I don't know if it's going to happen. It's okay, we plan for it. Huh? A blue, a blue dropped back here. What the? Another skeletal darts. What is this? I rolled a nut, a nut. Wait, another skeletal darts with a cold damage. That's crazy. It's crazy. Bonkers, dudes. All we need is bowstring. Please give me bowstring. Get me out of here. Whoops. Whoops. A bozo string. Yep. Yep. There's a Valor of Anchovies. Okay, at this rate, we can just get a Valor of Anchovies. Okay. 
Wait, I heard a charm. Heracles is my trash. Wait for a fix, yeah. Yeah, what else what else can you do? What else can you do? Hopefully hopefully you didn't pay for it. I paid too much for it. That feels real bad. I was reading a little bit about like um did you guys see that Star Wars Outlaws game? I'm pretty sure it's an Ubisoft game. But it's making headlines, shocking headlines for for an expensive collector's edition. As if people have never seen that before. Shocking. People can't believe. Oh my god, I can't believe. But it is something ridiculous. It's like $120. <laughs> That's one of those things, it's just like just buy just buy it when it's like twenty bucks a year later you know buy it when it's five bucks two years later just wait who cares oh there it is nice bowstring bozo string acquired hell yeah hell yeah there's there's a man in here there he is i just wanted to open box Anakin meme. <laughs> Relics recovered. Items reclaimed. Okay, string and string. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, remember, 518 points of damage. 518 points of damage is all we're trying to beat. Okay, all we're trying to beat. So we're we're almost there. Almost there with one charm. 518. I will need the formula and all the regions. Oh, I need two million gold to remove this. Uh oh. Mm, mm, mm. Thank you. Um. <laughs> um, bummer, dudes. Looks like I gotta go get some gold. Bummer dudes. Alright, hold on. I think we go do Babylon. Watch the Kong movie. Do you like that movie? The King Kong. You leave that sheep harmony alone. You have no more room. I have no more room. 
I have plenty of room. Okay, back to, let's see, let, let's go to the north just in case. I think it was from 2005. Oh yeah, Peter Jackson's, oh yeah. What's my method of gold farming? I just pick up yellows. Quest related monsters have a pretty high drop chance for yellows. There's, um, you know, five, five, about five spots in the game that have quest related monsters that you can farm pretty easily. Wow, where did I get this? It's pretty crazy. Okay, let's let's do a pyrus. A pyrus should give me a lot more. Um, a pyrus. What's the least played class combo? Dang, I have no idea. I suppose it would be different for everyone. Um, my least played would probably be... Hmm. Honestly, it would probably be hunting and... I don't know. I actually don't know. That's a good question, though. I feel like for a while, I didn't play, um... Rogue and Spirit a lot, but then that's just not true because I played a lot of Spirit previously. Just like took a break from it. Definitely Rogue, I haven't played a lot of like historically just because wow, Pegasus boots. Holy, holy, and Griffin Bracers. What the hell? Holy elemental damage. Uh, yeah, I would I would say it's like for me it's kind of like probably rogue and spirit maybe. <laughs> Who's your epic mama? That's what I would say. But that's just for me, cause like I know I know that's like wrong. Cur wait, curative of journeying. Dang, that's a good combo too. All right, let's let's go sell. This this should be enough gold. Should be. Maybe shaman. I played a lot of shamans. Well, I shouldn't say a lot, but I I played shaman. Shaman's pretty cool class. Yeah, like like I said, it would kind of probably really depend on the person. Excellent. Th this one gave us a lot more gold. I think we're just... We, I think we just have enough. Is that what I think it is? <laughs> oh. <laughs> we need 100k gold. Alright, our last area to farm gold. Lower Nile. Lower Nile. Hello! What Hello, Madral. Happy Friday. Uh, do I play all classes? Yes. Oh, yes. A magician? What is that? St a storm and rogue? I've played, I've played a, I've played a magician or two on stream for sure. And I've played it off stream. I know that. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I actually have no idea. Okay, do we get enough gold? Hopefully we have enough gold. Play classes that the wheel gives you. Yep. Respect the wheel. Exclamation point wheel. Spin the wheel. Okay, please give me 100k gold. Yes, please. Please. Dude, no. <laughs> That's so annoying. I need sound anyways. Let's go ahead and reset. Uh, somebody was asking about gold 
let me let me hit you with a gold video. Uh, just explaining what I kind of just did. There you go. That video, and then that block of text is uh, is helpful. But the video is the most helpful, honestly. I guess I think we'll just do um I think we'll just do one a Pyrus run. And then fi finally we'll be done with this Garbo. I can smell your blood. Hello Kaz. Happy Friday. Life, yes, I remember. It's long ago. Wow. Poison res plus hunt. Um I actually don't I actually don't need poison res at all on this character. Who needs poison res with the herbal remedy? Sorry, I mean herbal remedy. Sorry, herbal. What the? One yellow item? What the? Where are my drops? There we go. time it's time finally the market is busy again almost too busy a cart nearly rammed into my stall can you believe it can you believe it may Hermes guide your way okay by, by the way welcome R.I.P. Bramble Belt. We, we have 518. That's all we're trying to beat. Uh, charm. Until next time. Yeah. <laughs> it's an upgrade. Now we just, now we actually have to use Study Prey, though. <laughs> it's an upgrade. I knew it would be. I knew it would be. Okay, boys. But was it worth it? Uh, there we go. Rip RR. No, I mean, I, st I still have Study Prey. I didn't get rid of that. But I already did this, right? Yeah. L let's go back to town. Forgot. We need to go to Egypt or Africa. I mean, back to Africa, boys. Yeehaw!
Tschüss. <lacht> das ist insane. Das ist insane. Um, the next build is... I don't actually remember. I think there's one in here that I deleted that's not showing up. Officially, unofficially, officially, the next one is Berserker. Yes. Warfare and Rune. But I think there's one in there. I have to check VODs. Make no I think there's one in there that I deleted. If you want any of the goods from our store that I haven't recovered. You need to pay for them. Oh, Tread I don't have any gold. Here. Why am I looking? Okay, we got to pick up all yellows. All ye yellows. My gambling debts are big. My gambling debts are big. Oh, God. He's so big. The precise 4K hit points. I know. It's pretty ridiculous, actually. I would never delete a build. Yeah, no, it was an accident. Not, I didn't mean to do it. It was an accident. I can't fight the bugs. I can't see them. I can't see the bugs. There's no fix for these bugs. Don't get petrified here, boys. What are you? What are you? Why does he say it like that? I will help you, sir. I will clear your stores. Wow, Grim of Tinkerer. Nice. I saw it. Study pray. Murder, murder, murder. Yo, oh my god. Actually, dude. <laughs> this bow's big. Sheesh. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy amounts of damage. Wow. Wow. I knew you could get We did it. Um Pure 480p quality from TV on YouTube. Wait, does everybody only have 480p on YouTube? Uh, 
Oh, is this slow leveling? Um. Because it is. It's it's day three and we're in Atlantis instead of like Epic. Lull. Lull. Three, uh, three eight-hour-plus streams and not in, uh, um... Not in epic difficulty. That's pretty slow. Lull. It's only on smart TV. Oh. Oh. Hello, YouTube. Hello, 480p YouTube. <laughs> Hello, Nars. Now, uh, the slow leveling was was uh, we transitioned away from speed leveling with with uh, Ring of Flame yeah, um, day one, and it was terrible. It was terrible. I was just illustrating basically. Um, Kind of, kind of just going slower. I mean, I could, I could take this off, sorry. Uh, I could take this off. This is actually not true. We're not leveling slow anymore. But I didn't think it mattered too much. I didn't think it mattered too much. You can't carry you can't anymore. I can't anymore. carry anymore. Hmm. Fine weapons. Look at them. The best. Jesus guide you. Jesus guide you, Delivering he says. Delivering wood and goods across the Mediterranean. You will find everything just like you left it. Just like I left it. Guys, don't f don't forget to do your gamer exercises. Touch your touch your thumb to your forearm. Massage your wrists, loosen them up. Thumb to forearm. Thumb to forearm. And then roll roll wrists. Good to go. Uh, how am I below one million gold? Well, you see. When you kill monsters, they have a chance to drop items, and those items can be picked up and stored in your inventory. When you go back to town, you can sell them for a price, and that will give you gold. And when you buy things from vendor or remove charms, that spends gold. Uh, so if you spend enough gold to go below one million gold, you will have less than Shut one million Shut the fuck gold. up, your plunk. <laughs> I mean, hey, he asked. <laughs> he asked. My best good. Hey, he asked. I'm just, I'm just, you know, when you when you spend gold, you you lose it. Five dollars a month. You know? you know what I'm saying?
My best goat is gone. We'll go save this man's goat. Nice red fist guards. Big Chungus health. Huge. Wonderful. Wonderful. Such a head is an even better sacrifice to the dark powers. Big damage. A letter for me. Yes, this is my caravan with guards, as you can see. Uh, hello, Lego man. May your stars be Some favorable. of our goods are for trade. Do you know carrot pods? You can use those to sweeten your provisions. <laughs> wow, Mentor's Osprey. It's trash. Um, let's see here. Safe travels. Into the garden. Pretty good damage. With or without study prey. Pretty good damage. Oh, almost got petrified.
Okay, let's just go kill this Dargan. We don't need a full clear. Kill the Dargan. Your epic mama. Good damage. That is some good damage. <laughs> Who is your epic mama? Yo, more damage. Faster, 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 faster. Faster, 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 faster. Yeah. No phase two. Yeehaw. Yeehaw. You ate chocolate with alcohol in in them. Oh, nice. That that's pretty normal. That's not uncommon. Like a like a brandy in the chocolate. It's not uncommon. Yes. He was, yeah, he was teaching while chocolate drunk. I have more magical trinkets and wonders from all over the known world. <laughs> Teary and purple. <laughs> Maybe next time. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, boys, we finally go oh, to actual city of Atlantis. I mean, the island of Atlantis. We found it. With this navigational device, we found it. Captain has instructed me to provide you with anything you need. I'm pooped. He's pooped. If you're going inland. <laughs> Return of a classic. You're going inland. Dude. Turn of a classic. He's probably going to play Super Super Mario Brothers. Uh, the reduced armor here is crazy. I wish it was not 30% chance. I think I wish it would be was just like like flat. Otherwise this thing is trash. It's trash. Season starts. T3 seasons is always fun for like a day, you know, two days at most. 
because it's just so fast anymore. You're like, well, I'm done. Like, most modern RPGs, in my opinion, are like very arcadey, right? Numbers pop up, high score pops up, you know, there's, there's little health pickups. Very little progression. Or like... Just weird grinds. I don't, I don't feel attached to really anything, honestly. I'll tell you what. Auto pickup stuff in, in modern ARPGs... Like when you just you just walk over stuff and it just picks it up. I love it and I hate it at the same time. I mostly hate it, and that's one of those things that I know people like claim they want. Like for example, you know, <laughs> gold auto picks up in Last E5, but relic shards don't. If everything auto picked up, it de th there would be there would be some weird psychological effects it would I, for, in my brain I would I would not like it I don't know I don't know how to explain it I don't know how to describe it but I definitely would not like it it's like the game most people think they want the game to kind of like play itself and you're just like well I don't think I want that And Diablo 3 is certainly guilty of a lot of a lot of the, these weird modern conveniences. Like they crunch the speed, they speed up the game. It's not really a bad thing. Cause like once you start down that slope, you just pick up speed, right? Once you, once you start making these decisions to deliberately increase the you know, de decrease the time it takes to level up. There's no going back. You can't, there's no going back. Pee Wee tried. They added ruthless mode. No one plays it. <laughs> no one plays it. Right? You can't get those those casual dad gamers. Who, those are the ones that swipe a ton of gold. Uh, IRL gold for the 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 skins. Right. Anyways. We get it, you like Titan Quest, quest G's? Oh, sorry. <laughs> you can't hold anymore. I wasn't really talking, talking about Titan Quest, to be honest with you. This wagon held two steers of cedar flags. Mind if I make a sketch of these in my Don't journal? Don't touch my stuff. It's trying to make a sketch. Don't touch my stuff. Don't touch my stuff, dude. Got 
is a lot of damage right there. Excellent level up. Um, honestly, it's time. The time is not. No, I lied. Sorry. Soon. Soon. Soon, TM. <laughs> I lied. Sorry. Uh. You guys want to see? You guys want to see monster lure? It's time. It's the the build has come online. Log in. Log in. Monster lure, log in. It worked. It did zero damage, it worked. It's not luring monsters. There he goes. Not luring monsters. <laughs> what a bullshit ability. It's almost about to blow up. There it goes. Wow. <laughs> Yes. You, you yes. I will kill your your enemies. One monster down, boys. Yeah. 
Iznu? Have you seen Iznu? My cock. We did it, boys. Yeehaw. Quest complete. Nope. Quest complete. It was enormous. Is that perfect block shield? It's not. It's not. RAP gamers. Who's your epic mama? Yes. I need the fruit. I need the fruit. Yo, what the fuck? Fuck you guys. What the? What the? Bozo mean? It's like uh, Bozo the Clown. And so when you when you just say Bozo, you're just calling somebody a clown. B -b -b Bozo. B -b -b Bozo. Wait, do I already have one in my sack? I do. That's why. I was like, why is this not Hello. being picked up? That would be a bozo moment. You are a clown.
What a great day. Wow, that's some big damage. This monster lure is doing nothing. Ah, raiders! Ah! Ah! We're being raided! Put your hands up! Ah! <laughs> Hello, Mythical Mary. Welcome in, Raiders. Nice to see you guys. Happy Friday! Yeehaw! What is going on? Hope you had a good stream. No rips. <laughs> ah, Raiders! Hello, gamers. We are in Atlantis. Shooting things with a bow. Well, I don't get many visitors. <laughs> Hello, man, beer bro. Welcome in. Thank you Who's for the follow. Mama? Hello, guys. Sheesh. That's a lot of damage. Sheesh. Who is your epic mama? Who is your daddy and what does he do? That's the most important question. Yo, were I actually committed to doing all side quests in Atlantis? Hello. Why would what I do a such a thing? Day. Hello, Patch Up. Happy Friday. What is going on? <laughs> I'm your instructor. More energy. Five five dollars a month. Hello, Mr. Conti. Happy Friday. Yo, these lobsters, they just wanna eat. They just wanna eat. I just put hello, I just put Earth Shield on my monster lure. That was not useful. <laughs> That was not useful. Okay. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Put that cookie down. Put that cocaine down. Okay, um, I lost buff. No, I lost Ring of Flame and Earth Enchantment. Okay, we, we are good now. I'm going to ask you a bunch of questions. I want them answered immediately. All right, will this blow up? It will not, it's not useful. There it goes. <laughs> okay, that actually is pretty cool. <laughs> Won't lie. Uh, pro tip or hot take, I think um, monster lure would actually be effective if you could throw it like a trap. I've said this for a long time, but since you can't, it's garbage. It's just garbage. Uh, how did the interview go? Good. Good. We are we are moving forward with plans. I may I may, I have plans. Soon I will not be homeless. How many people interviewed me? It was a it was a business dinner, and there were five people there. There were five people. It wasn't, it wasn't like, by the way, it wasn't traditional uh, interview format. 
I had worked with one of those persons before, and they were introducing me to four other, four other people who I could potentially uh, work for long term. You have no more room. Okay, let me let me go sell and get some gold back, baby. Baby. Uh I've seen that movie. Are they hot? Uh or who hot? What movie? Wow. Ha. Ah, this one knows the value of magical items. He goes, ah. <laughs> ah. I need I need blue pots. You blue made pots. the right choice. Hello, comrade. Hello. Welcome in. Symbols. <laughs> All command symbols. Uh, what do you say? Let, let's 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 stand for some Atlantis. Stand for some Atlantis. All right, we stand, gamers. Uh, okay, so I need I need a lot more quest uh, items. Quest items. Yeah, it's just not it's just not taunting off of me at all. Which I knew was going to happen. I knew it. Monster lure bad. If you didn't know, now you know. It does not lure monsters. Not lure the monsters. There it goes. I actually did get it to blow up. What do you know? <laughs> that is so bad. a lot of damage.
Wow, a cult. Nice. Look at this. A cult medallion. Big. Uh, monster lure, nice if it's maxed out, but it needs to be placed before the player attacks. Nautilus harness. Right. Nice. Actually use this. 30 pierce res. <laughs> that thing's really nice. <laughs> that thing's really nice. We drop a lot of Ellie res. Which I don't want to do.
Stranger. 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 You can't carry anymore. What? You can't carry what? anymore. Back to town, boys. Trash. Good on you. It's all trash. Coming here, this wagon held two steers of cedar planks. Freeze. There's somebody else. Wait, there's one other sculpture or thing, and I don't remember what it is. And I don't remember how I gave it to either. Can't remember. You will find everything just like you left it. Just like you left it. I left it a mess. Good job, little monster lure. You stood your ground and did nothing. Excellent. Excellent. Explosion. We did it. I stood still for an hour. <laughs> uh oh. That that could have been a death. Holy crap. That lag was insane. Stagger OP. Damn, 102 vitality reds. <laughs> That's insane. That's absolutely insane. Absolutely insane.
Please. Please, Monster Lord. Thank you. Holy crap. Holy crap. Does nothing. Your inventory is full. My inventory is full. Celtic weapons from Iberia and beyond. Enjoy. I almost ruined myself with these prices. Blessed be Melkart. Bags already, holy smokes. So many spears. You can't Your carry the inventory is full. Oh, 
Oh, I'm missing a piece. What what piece am I missing? Spare parts. Stranger, I have oh, seen the anvil. helping shit. Out. I always miss the anvil. Right? Happy Friday. What is going on? Jesus gate. What else? Ha. Huh. <gasps> yes. Oh. Tinkerer amulet. Looks good on you. Coming here, this wagon held two steers of cedar planks. Uh, okay. Don't worry. Atlantis is going good. We're almost done, actually. Uh, then we do Act 5, and hopefully later today we can get to Act 1 Epic. Should be no problem. Famous last words. Then we start grinding Epic. You really killed him? I killed them. I really killed them. Okay, wait. Where where is Yeah, I think I passed it. It's in the bathhouse, isn't it? I always, I always miss these three pieces. I got this, right? Let's see. This was the spare parts. Ah, wow, what did this roll? Feasting? Artifice parts, yeah. I always miss at least one of them, and it's a, a large character flaw. Miko. Reassess and improve my front deltoid workout. Nice. It's always good to reassess. Excellent working out, my boy. the bathhouse. This is what I missed earlier. Back in the corner, boys. I just always walk right past it. It's over here. How am I? I'm good. I am good. I am sleepy and eternally overworked, but I am good. Today is a good day. Okay, big port. Big port.
Did I notice my my OP my OP throne destroys your health? It's stress me even if you don't use it currently. Ah, you'll be all right. Yeah, you'll be right. It's in my it's in my back button. A little bit of stress is good for the heart, you know. You'll be all right. Yay! Quest complete. I see you. Quest complete. A chunk of change. Nice. If you stress my heart, I start to fart. What? What? Loki. Pew, 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 pew. Poetry, yep. Yep. You, you, sir, you're going places. Not very fast or not very far or very important, but you are going places. Not once, not once has he hit my monster lord. <laughs> wow, Doomfang died him. And vitality based uh, mentor's cultist rod of rhyme. Dub double uh, uh, a nice cold affix, energy prefix, and vitality based staff. Pretty nice. Of course, there are much better. Get the better ones. Go into the bathroom. <laughs> Big bomb. Big bomb. Okay, baby. Just a few short rooms and we got some Tiamat. Big old sneaky snake. Wow. Wow. Uh, beasts and beastmen bonus damage. Minus 31 strength. Minus 31 strength. Well, that's not fun. That's an Atlantis item if I've ever seen one, though. Wait, is that 15? Yeah, it's 15% dex. Look at this. Look how much decks we get. 124 decks. <laughs> That's insane. It's absolutely insane. That's good resistance. We'll keep it. I don't think I need it, though. Big bump. This is my spirit animal. Okay, well, I put, I, I put, I thought I put uh, monster lure down, but I did not. We'll do it here. Salve There we go. That's a decent explosion. Not enough energy. It's the gold cap. 
Minus recharge, minus energy costs, plus to skills. Big Pog. Big Pog. I have, have no, no more room. room. Okay, we have to go sell. We are getting the gold, though. Yo, it's a body, yes. Getting the gold. Another one. Oops. Oh, oh uh, uh, hi. I'll keep boots. Why not? Why not? Epic difficulty is coming up. Check back next week. My final offer. His final offer. He will offer no more. Blessed be Melkart. Did I? Yes, I did. Ha. Okay, boys. Uh, can I give advice? If my build has doesn't have the ability to de decrease enemies' resistance, if I meet undead or magical, uh, uh. Yeah, yeah, get get items get items that reduce resistance. Um I recommend Monkey King's trickery or um or uh, there's another charm that goes on weapons called um Shen Shen Pong's medicine. Then then not to mention there's a plethora of items that reduce resistances. Um but if you're struggling to kill undead brain or on. magical, my brain, my brain is broken. Then um, consider adding a different damage type on your weapons. You can get racial damage, right? Bonus damage to undead, bonus damage to magical. Um, what is the uh, what is the relic? What is it? Isis or? Uh, no, not Isis. What? What's the damage to undead? Osiris. This guy. This is something you want. So this is the normal bonus, right? The normal completion. And then you could get really lucky and get this completion. And just put that on your weapon. And just have a swap weapon. There's all kinds of options. There's all kinds of options. Uh, sometimes you just gotta vendor vendor shop a little bit, get a swap weapon. Hopefully that helps a little bit. What masteries are you running? Cause I'm trying to think, there's not that many masteries that don't have minus resistance. Right? Or some sort of RR. Not that many. Pew, 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 pew. Yo, I, I need to get... <laughs> okay, well. One down. Yeah, well, that, well, yeah, Earth Earth has minus armor, and Rogue, I don't think, has any. It just has racial bonus, yeah. I, okay, minus armor, I, you know, it's, uh, it's nitpicky. Right. I 
I try specific gameplay style that many don't like. Okay. Brainal moment. What is this? Oh. Brainal. My brain my brain is broken. Oh, that's weird. Why did I say it so fast? Spinal. Spinal. Brainal. My brain my brain is broken. <laughs> oh, the command is slowed down. Oh. <laughs> Ew, I don't like that. <laughs> um yeah, if you're if you're if you're doing rogue uh and earth you don't really need a lot of RR, but like, okay, so as an example, um, as an example, brain all my brain, my brain see, is broke. See that that's that's what I that, that's the normal command. Uh, so as an example, you're going to be juicing physical damage. One of the things that you can do, so you probably have po your venom weapon, you probably have earth enchantment, you probably have all kinds of stuff. One of the things you can do if you have a blade barrier. Go get Monkey King's Trickery. This here. And get it on, you know, get it, get a legendary one. Um, um, this guy here. This, because this has 12 RR for four seconds, which doesn't sound like a lot, but it is. But it, it is. And put that on a ring. Preferably, you get it one Tinkerer ring and get a legendary plus uh, an epic one. So then it's 9 plus 12. And that gets applied by auto attacks. That gets applied by blade barrier. That gets applied by ring. I mean, um, knives. So, you know, there's, 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 you don't need a lot. And, and Rogue, honestly, just has tons, tons of d damage to begin with. So, yeah. If you're talking about fire damage resistance, like from Surger, just just juice out like calculated strike or something. Just swap up some skills. You know. Hello, hollow. All right, boys. We got a telkin to Hero, kill. You have... Wait. Do you feel that? Do you feel that? Hey, ah. Wow, just a random hallowed hat. Just get one. Just get a random hallowed hat. Uh, you make three elemental knives and my build doesn't give you enough options to restore energy. Yeah, just drink potion. Just drink potion on a chest piece. On chest piece, you want to put, um, if you can, put, uh, what's it called? Fleece. If you can, just get this. Minus 15 energy costs. This is a normal one. On legendary, it gives minus thirty percent. Just put that on a chess piece. You know, uh, you can also go the other route, which is stack strength. You can get Eldemir's stew. Um, you can get Eldemir's stew, which is flat twelve energy regen and twelve percent strength. Right. That this is a legendary one, by the way. Um, you could you could do that. That also goes on chess piece. Um, you can also My get belly hungers um, for stew. Crescent. How do you spell it? Um, this is this is normal. You could get twelve percent energy and a bit of energy regen. This is the aim. Here is the flat energy bonus. Um, that's the aim. You can also. There's another charm that's probably better, but like de just depending on where you are in the campaign. So. Yeah. 
Uh, you can also get Spellbound. Um, spellbound, right? If if you you can get this on an amulet, Spellbound is minus energy cost, right? If you get it on armor, it does this. But if you get it on amulet, it does this. So you just gotta you got you just gotta farm a little bit. You gotta find the items that uh, that benefit your playstyle, basically. So. Otherwise, and there's no getting around it, basically. You're gonna have to drink blue pots. You're just gonna have to drink them. You can't carry any. Hopefully that helps. Hopefully you're you're getting some knowledge. Getting some juice. Let loose the juice. Alright guys, give me one second. I'm gonna use the restroom and uh, check on the bunny. Give him some food. Give me one second, guys. Beer beat. Okay, boys. Okay, boys. I have no strength, but I have agility. Excellent. Uh, you can use spears. Yeah, nice. So you should probably go farm. Um, you should probably go farm the mud butt. How do you spell it? How do you spell it? There it is. Oh, a oh, M B. <laughs> I literally spelled mud. <laughs> okay, you should probably go farm this for study prey. It's just easy. It's just easy. Yeah, it's just easy. This gives study prey, right? F minus thirty fizz res, minus thirty pierce res. This is a legendary version. 
So that's pretty easy. There's lots of ways to reduce resistances, lots of ways to increase damage, all kinds of things. Do the things that makes the things good. My final offer. Maybe next time. For spices, you can go east. But for iron, you go north. Jesus guide you. Okay, boys. If you scale your secondary damage type, it's a bonus. Many builds don't scale secondary, tertiary damage types. Yep. Yep. Yeah, basically, both masteries that you choose, no matter what they are, they're going to support a good handful of damage types. It's like Warfare, you might think it's only physical damage. It's not. It's Bleed. It's Pierce. Right? There's even a, a little bit of uh, uh, health damage in, in Warfare. So... And then you have two masteries, so there's all kinds of damage types that you can support. Not to mention, just random added flat damage to uh, um, weapons and gear it goes a long way. It goes a long way. Can I say level 32 fire passive? Oh, um, yeah, it's it. Yeah, it's a chance to just if you're doing damage, it's a chance to uh, multiply uh, the amount of damage those types of skills do on on anything. So it's global. Please. <laughs> it took so long for Monster Lure to die. Oh my gosh. Okay, boys. It's time for the Telkin. Are you guys ready? Monster Lure. Let's go. Best, best skill in the game. First one still hasn't blown up yet. There we go. Oh no! Oh no! We didn't kill it. It's gotten bigger. Okay, boys. It's time for Act Five. Uh, actually, I lied. You can't carry. I lied. Uh, who do those items go to? Who do those items go to? 
Who's your epic your... mama? I can't remember though. Is it this person? Is it this person? You found another. Thanks again. Thanks again. And oh. uh, I know who these items belong to. They belong to everyone. Okay, boys, time for Act 5. Sit with me, brothers. Sit with me, brothers. Actually, we could gamble, right? We could gamble a little bit of a little bit of juice. Since I didn't get that good, that many good items. Well, well, we did. Okay, I lied. We we did get murderers of Tinkerer, but I mean, like blue items. I want to really pog like. I don't actually know what I would want, but I want pog items. Okay. Well, oh. Let me go. Okay. Let me go gamble. Let me go gamble real quick. Become addicted today. Epic today? Yeah, pr I'm pretty sure. There's no reason not to. I have plenty of time. Welcome, traveler. I'm what you would call a transmitter. If you seek the thrill of the betting game, I can provide them back anytime. That's a lot of blues. <laughs> this band? Hey. Who's Asshole Dell band? Mama? This Asphodel band is really good. Health, health regen, energy, energy regen, and stats. Big stats. Diesel. I don't know if we're gonna use it, but it's it's poggy. It's poggy. Uh, everything else is kind of trash. Uh, bow of so yo spring vine. Okay, that's the the that's the way mine looks. It's like weird curve, you know. And, and then both the both of these both of these um bows are incredible. Sorry, flashbang. Sorry, flashbang. Flirt, flashbang. Okay. Okay, this is spring vine. This this is. Sometimes, if you're just honest, this is what it looks like, you know? And Bow of Selene. Wait, hold on. Wait, I lied. I, th this, what, what is the, what is the, um, hold on. What is the Atlantis, maybe it's a rag bow. There's a bow from rag that I was referring to. This one. <laughs> This is how mine curves. That's the joke I was making. It doesn't make sense if it doesn't have the curve. <laughs> so, it, it just be that way. Uh, <laughs> but spring vine. Okay, so less less damage from plants th is biggest. But thirty percent total speed. That's why you get it. it. Doesn't matter what else is on it. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Is no. Um, and then Bow of Selene. I don't remember this one. <laughs> Minus 30 fire res? Hell yeah. <laughs> why do you want, why do you recommend this? Uh, Nymph Bow? Yeah. Yeah, this, th this thing is insane. 
This thing is insane. It's epic though, right? Oh no, it is. Oh, you can't get it on normal. Yeah, we could, we could go get this. Look, flat pierce. This is nice added stuff. It's not going to proc a ton. It's not a ton of damage, but it's nice. Poison res. Uh, nature or uh, hunting never needs it, but whatever. Um, and then 30% attack speed. Like, what the f Right? It's huge. And then dodge and avoid. Always good. Just It just is. Flat health regen. Big pog. Not kidding. And then also additional 10% speed. Now... We're not Rune of Life, and we're not Nature, but that doesn't matter. It's still good. Also, this uh, this Nature's Wrath is Pog. Is Pog. Um, you have a chance to proc elemental damage, and it's a, and it's a pass-through. It's just really, really big. Trust. Trust. Okay, so... That being said, no, I'm, I'm probably not going to farm lobster ideas. I just... We'll, we'll keep gambling. Like, I love, ga I love the Gamba, uh, obviously. Um, but I do, I do want to move on. If I was going to farm anything, it would be the boar. And, um, yeah. Your we, inventory I, I think, I think, ra I love farming rag and I love gambling in, in Atlantis. That's, that's essentially, that's essentially how my loot, um, kind of shakes out basically. Check back next week. Uh, Epic Mamas on D3. Pog in. Nice. Wait, does it launch today, the uh, season? You guys were talking about that earlier. Another one. Oops. Oops. Okay, we're good, right? Yep. Okay. Uh, the cold plus, yeah, okay, plus fizz, yeah. Alfheim uh, on black elves. Yeah, it's um, it's yeah. Sadly, it's wait. Alfheim is also um the. I can't remember. I think it's just the black elves. I don't think it's from. I don't think it's from the. The monsters that drop the. Can't, my brain is like completely off right now. I think it's just black elves. Yeah, sadly. Gamba addict. Yeah, it's true. Telkin weapon is good. You mean the um? The finest purple from Sidon and Tyr. Quest item, weapon. It's okay. It's okay. It's it. It's fun to play with. Don't it's fun to make to a meme build out of it. But it takes a lot of work to get it equipped. Okay, boys. No, the um, what I was thinking was, uh, yeah, just Muspelheim. You you can't get it from the when you first get to Alfheim. There's the lady. Is they're not nymphs? What are they? That drop the plus to skills on boots. Those do not drop the Alfheim uh, set. It's they're different. They're like so similar, but they're different. What is that called? <laughs> I'm going crazy. Greeting, citizen. Ariston says what? Uh, 
Yeah, what's what's their what's their um their intelligence boots with plus to skills? What is that called? Oh my gosh, it's driving me crazy. Anyways, I'm pretty sure those those little white you know white elf nixy friendly things they they cannot drop the uh, Alfheim set, sadly. Uh, yeah, Valkyrie. Yeah, yeah. Bo boots of the Valkyrie. Yeah, the the mobs that drop the bo the boots of the Valkyrie. I'm I'm ninety percent sure, but you should check uh, for yourself that they can't drop what you're looking for. Sadly. Yeah, he's Adios, He's talking about the um, the quest, uh, the sickle of Kronos. Is it good? Well, I yeah, I don't know. Is it good? What what does good mean? <laughs> I, don't know. I can't answer that. I'm just gonna say no. I always throw them away. Lure, lure the monster. Do your job. There's two of them. The skill's ass. This this skill is ass. Who's still alive? Wow, reflection. Just get reflection ring. Yes, these are in glass bottles. Yes, these are in glass bottles. May Hermes guide your way. May Hermes guide your way. Don't give me it Hermes. Is easy. Those triton balls. Oh, dude, big, big level up, boys. You, you guys know what that means. More. Yes. Wait. We get more explosion? Or do we get better taunt? Better taunt, larger radius. Look, you guys wanted to see it. You guys wanted to see it. It's in the build. Or do we go eruption? <laughs> go useful skills. <laughs> Easy. 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 Young warrior. Where's the blue ball? Untie these strands of fate. Get out of here, Your monster lure. Have been made. This thing's trash. Okay, what what would we get? Fragments? Fragments better, right? Or uh do we climb bar maybe? We should probably climb bar for uh for attributes. Okay, rest in peace, 4k hit points. We're breaking the barrier. We're bre breaking the barrier. <laughs> it's been real. It's been fun. And it's been real fun. Uh, max level is is uh, 85. Yeah. Max level... I, think, I don't think you need DLC with it, actually. Now that I think about it. I can't remember. I'm sure it's listed somewhere. Shoot. 
Sheesh. Okay, so set. Yeah. Okay, so seventy-five uh, pr pr prior to um, you know, prior to rag. I thought they changed that, but th there's just so many like little little points, and it's been so long since I've had to think about the game without DLC. Yeah, do we wear this? Hold on. Do we wear this? We lose elemental res. Have you seen Isno? For big health, that's 700 hit points. Uh, that's 700 hit points and a lot of armor. Yeah, let's try for a little bit. Need more energy. Yeah, more energy. Literally, more energy. Greetings, traveler. Yo, what's up, Luke? Um, eighty five doesn't make sense. Yeah. yeah, I mean, dude, honestly, even even with eternal embers and a and a fairly casual playthrough like of everything on all difficulties all DLC you're just, you're just barely gonna break 75, 76, right and that's with decent amount of farming 78 maybe maybe if you're a really grinder it's different with, you know, it's different with curses a little bit Cause like uh, you know you'll get the XP bonus. I mean you could really giga farm, I suppose, but just just casually playing, just or like uh, or like um, you're just not gonna hit 85. In uh, yeah. Guys, I miss monster lore. Is it? Can it be possible to miss monster lore? Can it be possible? Come on, boys. <laughs> Come on, boys. More energy. I heard a bunch of horns, and that was not my horn. Pristine plumage. Yeehaw! Monster refund. Yeah, exactly. Alright. I need it in my life. Today I am I am tired. I am very tired. Ow, stop. I got up super early. Super early and I stayed up too late like an old man. Man, come on. I just want to pour my drink for my for for my people. Get out of here. Stop pulling. Okay. This is for you guys. Yo, that that that's pretty tall. That's pretty good. I could be a bartender. I heard something. Uh, three hours? I can't do three hours. I function really, really, really well with four. Um, but I can't. I can't do th three hours. Is just like it's like two. It's two in between for me. I suppose there's science behind like REM cycles or like three or like three hours. 
And so, you know, it takes me a little bit to fall asleep, so I'm assuming I probably only sleep a solid three hours when I, three and a half hours, something like that. But yeah, I, I can't, I can't do three hours. What? What? That's literally the same piece I'm wearing. And I just got one five minutes ago. <laughs> and it's better. 1% uh, less health, but other everything else is better. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. Shut the fuck up, Carl. But we do lose, we do lose 40 hit points. That's fine. I'm, I'm fine with that. Okay, I won't face tank him. Holy smokes. Yo, campaigning boots. Campaigning boots. 28 move speed. Wow. Become fast. Uh, run cycle is two hours. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I suppose that makes sense why my my, my four-hour naps work well for me. My nappy poos. I could probably do like a two-hour nap and be be good for a day and a half, two days maybe. But I don't. I don't think I would want to do that. I already worked too much. I just want to game more. More games, please. More games. More pogs. Yes, bye. Skyrim is Skyrim is dead. Oh wait, actually, hold on. So I brought goddamn hard. You brought it from the island of Zante. The island of Zante. By the way, I just want to point out, I still have my short bow of the hunt that I spent, I sold all my gold to become naked for and never used it. <laughs> uh, if you didn't know, now you know. It's an you have it! Well, oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. Yeah, Sky Skyrim is dead, exactly. Exactly. Just ask Naomi. 90 gigabyte mod patch crashes. Who knew? Who knew? Day one mod list update doesn't work. Who knew that would happen? Hmm. Beep beep. It's like, yeah, exactly. It's modern. It's modern day, like Doom, right? Doom can run on your refrigerator. Skyrim also has a, a smart refrigerator copy on the way. <laughs> it's the same thing. If it can run Doom, it will. It will run Doom. If you can sell Skyrim on it, they will make Skyrim for it. <laughs>
Guys, are we just speeding to, uh, should we just speed to more? I don't know what charms I need. But I think I just want to speed to the board. Yes. Although, although this bow, murderous of Tinkerer, will will I actually get? <laughs> will I want to get rid of it? No. But I, but I will. If I, if I actually get nymph bow, that would be pog. No, n no joke. We could also get. There's actually, there's actually pretty good items we can get from board. We, we should farm them. At least like ten, you know, ten to twenty runs at least, huh? Oh my god, are you kidding me? When you don't talk to stupid fake Loki or fake princess, the boatman won't let you cross. It must be. It must be you. Now let me have the damn boat, okay? Huh? Travel to Helos? What? No. Travel the boat. The boat? The boat? The boat? We don't have that command, do we? Oh. Nymph bow can literally be replaced mid to late legendary? Yeah, damn, yeah. If that's true. Hey you, yeah you. Hey you, yeah you. Hey, hey, hey. Ha <laughs> ha. Greetings, stranger. I'm looking after these goods until my master, the great druid Artibuts, returns from the forest. Can I interest you in something? Goodbye. Ta ta. Hail, soldier. I come again. Ta ta. Welcome, warrior. <laughs> the great druid octopus. <laughs> what an octopus. some bacon. Woo. I'm a sniper. Pew. 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 I need fountain. There, fountain. Uh, what's bleed res? Good question. Zero. <laughs> you should be all right. I just won't face tank. The mine is closed. Imagine, imagine bleed res. What is bleed res?
What is resistances? You know, the more I do this quest, the more I actually hate that I do this quest. It's so annoying. It's actually so annoying. Nope. We hate it, precious. I love mushrooms. No, mu mushroom quest is fine. This quest is bad. This is bad. It's like the cave is too narrow. I, well, I guess I get it. It's a mine, right? I get it. But it's just annoying. It, it, it's almost as annoying as doing the Makai quest, the friendly Makai quest in Act 4. Dude, anyone that does that Makai quest, zero, zero respect. Nope. <laughs> you skip it? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this this quest I just I don't know. And I never give it to the Gorkin. That thing is under our laws. I just never do. inherit her husband's possessions. Gorkin was declared an outlaw. Makai with portal trick is fine. So oh, yeah, I mean skipping it is even easier. Me by right. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. I'm not sure if I want to keep it yet, but Yeah, just easy. It's just even easier. Same thing with like Orpheus. I don't. I don't actually. It's weird. I don't actually mind doing the Orpheus quest. Uh, but that one also can't can't like can be annoying. And like, here's the thing. Here's one of the things that like gets to me. XP, in my opinion, is the wor is one of the worst rewards unless it's like massive, like massive amounts of XP. I, I just can't be bothered. <laughs> I can't be bothered. I'm gonna go grind out like ten levels farming, you know. Can't, I just can't be bothered. If skipping is easier, why the hell do you bother with most monsters in your playthrough? I don't know. I don't know. You, you seem to have answers. I'm sure you can figure it out. Gazel! I'm sure. You seem, you seem quite capable. Actually, no, let, let, let me explain. Let me explain. I, I meant squip, skipping uh, annoying... Skipping annoying quests. And then you equated it to skip um, all monsters. Which I think is not the point I was trying to make. Skipping annoying quests is easy. Right? That, that, that's, all, that's all I meant. There we are. Uh... Oh, okay, sorry. I also didn't answer your question. Why do I bother with most monsters? Uh, because charms... Uh, charms don't far between quests and monsters. Charms don't come from quests, with few exceptions. Uh, items rarely come from quests, with few exceptions. That that that's why you know. So to answer your your question. He. Yeah, that's why I don't you know skip most monsters. Oh, I um. To, to answer I your question. You come in. You kind of a troll you sometimes. Yeah. Came for some hunting supplies, yeah. Correct. 
I it, have some it here. most of the time doesn't bother me, but right now it's kind of bothering me. Uh. Used to be religious with XP gear, but now I just can't be bothered most guys. of the time. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, XP gear XP gear is is great, but again, you have the most benefit when when a quest completes, Good. right? Fine. And then it's like uh it's like um my ADHD brain kind of like, you know, even that one swap piece I forget to swap to it. <laughs> Especially if it's like sacrificial, I would hate to remember to swap to it and not turn it off. <laughs> Like swap to sacrificial and forget to turn it off. Yeah, that is absolutely something I would do. You know. Did that monster just disappear? Maybe I'm go maybe I'm maybe I'm missing some sleep. I swear, I swear one of those monsters just dis like disappeared. I'm an old man. Out of here, doggies. I am glad. Uh, don't they dissolve or melt away when they die? Or was it a troll? I think I missed Fountain. Oh no, I didn't. Good. Time to go talk to the octopus.
Uh, oh, did I miss a question? Sorry. Sorry. Small brain. Small brain. So you have found my golden brain on. That throne my brain. My it? brain is broken. I remember what? Oh, I don't even know what the question was. My beer. Uh. Hmm. My wine. <laughs> it's Friday. It's got to be five o'clock somewhere. Beer and wine o'clock. Hmm. What the last level in normal you can get the relics from trick board? I see. Well, it's funny you should ask. It's funny you should ask. If you do, Charm. Oops. This, vi this video here. This sweet, sweet video. At the end. Who's your epic mama? At the end. At 43. The same. See? 42 is the last level. Thing can be applied on epic and left. Uh, charms at once you hit 43. The same thing can be a um, level 43. These charms disappear. They will no longer sell. 42 uh, is the last level. There you go. 42 on normal, 55 on epic, 66 on legendary. There you go. Every time you hit the charm command, that video is linked. Commit it to memory. Because I will forget. Now you know. If you didn't know, now you know. Now you know. If you didn't know, now you know. Uh, Lou lied. Well, if he said forty-three, he just prob he was probably just answering like, when did they disappear? That kind of thing. I don't think he lied intentionally. Forty-two at the start of Act Five. Wait, weren't you like drastically underleveled fighting Hades, and now you're overleveled going to Act Five? Oh boy. Oh boy. It's the curse of the full clear. It's the curse of the full clear. If you guys full clear, I get it. Get it. I understand. Uh, see, he says I managed to make it to level 52 epic, act 5 for the charms, and innate curse is what I gave up to get there. That character's not fun. I stopped playing him. <laughs> Excellent. Excellent. Well, my th my thing about like 
My thing about the charms is like, there we are. you don't have to do that. It's just like, if you don't want to farm for the charms, or like maybe you're not going to like farm an act five boss or something, then, then you, you could buy them, right? Act four and five charms. It's pretty appealing. It's just a trick. You don't you don't, like you don't have to do it. <laughs> Die then. Big mistake. Yo. Kill kill the mobs. Okay, ban banner man Halt. dead. Easy. Easy. Two different characters. Oh, okay. I see. That makes sense. Yeah, golden belt incoming. Yo, it's up to our man. Hello, hello, gamer. Happy Friday. Nice to see you, dude. Oh, oops, wrong way. Wrong man. Traveros. Yeah, bot. Yeah, it's true. So, yo, Song of Serpent's actually not bad. Uh, we don't need Poison Res, but... This de eh, that, that's a decent, uh... Decent artifact. Oh, I'm an old man. It's trash, actually. It's trash. I take it back. <laughs> I take it back. It's trash. We hate it. May Hermes guide your way. May Hermes guide your way. Hello! What a great day! I will admit, though, being able to buy Will, will of Ajax, as, as you mentioned. Also, Persephone's Tears, pretty nice purchase. Um, like if, if you randomly need them. <laughs> yeah, they're <laughs> yeah. Okay, if you guys didn't know this, look. If you guys didn't know this, they have they. Ha it's like they all look like little boxes, little treasure boxes. You guys see this? If you didn't know, now you know. <laughs> now you know. Want to know how I know? Most likely what happened was your inventory gets is full and you complete that quest and then it falls on the ground and you go, What? It has a model? That's, pro that's probably how it happened. Well, also, it's kind of one of those things where, like, let me see if I can illustrate this. Actually, uh, this is a, this is a good example. This is a, this is a really good example here. We've got Storm Raven sw Sword, right? We got Storm Raven sw Sword. Okay, it's it's a monster in frequent color. If we put Lupine Claw on it and drop it, it's orange. Oh wait, it's not orange. Okay, other items become orange. Hold. Hold. When you put a charm on yellow items, it becomes orange when you drop it. I guess it doesn't do it for monster and frequency. I'm learning myself. Huh? Huh? Watch. Hello. Uh, what what, we, we just day. waste one of these. There you go. Look, this bow is yellow in bag. Yellow quality. If you drop it... Huh? Where'd that go? Huh? Oh, it's settling. It's settling. Do you, do you see the orange little shimmeries? It's probably hard to tell, but there's orange shimmeries. So the tooltip will be orange. 
It's settling though. Hold. Time out. Yeah. See? Orange. And that's and that's if you have a, a charm on it, by the way. If you didn't know, now you know. There are orange items in the game. What? <laughs> oh. Uh, to answer your question, I'm like, I'm existing. That's how I'm doing. What the fuck? Dude, you uh, uh, you are breathing air. Breathing air. Well, I can appreciate that. Continue to breathe air, sir. Yep. Yep. Otherwise, I'd never know. It's just like weird. It's like weird shit that why would you do that, you know? <laughs> Yeah. Top 10 things that you didn't know about Titan Quest. Number one. The Great Druid Artibus basically means big bear penis. That's that's the thumbnail. <laughs> that, that's the thumbnail there. 10 things you didn't know about Titan Quest. Beer. Man said, go away. <laughs> yeah, mages, in fact, are not actually bad. Oh my gosh. Ice, Will of Ajax, look at that. There we are. Why? Wine changes to wine changes to beer. It's good. Gorgon, the Gorgon cup, the Stonebinders cups often don't drop when you farm the queens. The queens are not the best place to farm the Gorgon cups, huh? <laughs> Huh? My wine. My wine. And there My wine. Uh the guy said he farmed queens from 37 to 52. <laughs> That's like an invitation for a depression. <laughs> Dude, I, I I tell myself, I, I tell myself, don't engage with chat uh, and don't read Titan Quest Discord and I fail every day. Yep, every day. Can't help it. Fuck you guys. Don't read TQ Discord. Yeah, you, <laughs> you are standing. Hey. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> hey, old foreign warrior. I hear you've come to win glory in battle. Good. Good. With these wow, Germans profaned. in our borders, wow. there are enough heads for everyone to collect. Ah, I wish I could join you. I wish I could join you. Open the gates. Let's go. Oh, you brought us some honey. Go ahead. <laughs> Random, just go ahead. Just go ahead. I can't see them. I can't see them.
I am blind. I can't see him. They're too, they're too invisible. <laughs> I, I did the same thing, Adios. I was like, <laughs> isn't there an open the gate version? They have t way too many fucking commands. Like, I I will be in the loony bin. Because I hear commands in the game. I hear them in my sleep. I hear them in chat. Cause of death. Sound commands. I was killed by sound commands. Victus. in design yeah I it, it, there are some monsters it's like it's like uh, you know Nixies most people it's okay you got you, it's okay you got you guys are actually allowed to hate Nixies that's what they're designed for same thing with like bees they're just annoying. but also like memorable is good good or bad like members memorable is a very very good thing well, and being like, let's say, visitors. hated because they're annoying or loved because, you know, like the former Sid heroes are amazing to kill. Right? They just, they're so satisfying. Th that makes things memorable. And so if Nixies weren't memorable, the worst thing in video games is like a forgetful like experience. Or, you know, too many forgetful experiences. Right? So. I don't know if I'm making sense. It makes sense in my brain. Um, Grievel28. There are 27 of you that fa failed before, but you are the 28th. Welcome in. Thanks for the follow, dude. I got a story about commands. I was at work during lunch. A guy was eating mushrooms on toast. <laughs> he said, man, I love mushrooms. <laughs> Dude, it triggered instantly in your brain and you can't help it. I know it did. <laughs> uh. <laughs> That's funny, dude. I'm, I'm struggling right now not to say it. Uh, is this the stream where there's Lord of the Rings sound horn command? Yeah. Just type in slash ban myself. See what happens. <laughs> yeah, br yeah, brain rot, exactly. Exactly, I have the same thing. Human! You shouldn't my pond. My would, you pond. Help me? would you help me? Would you help me? Would you help me? Would you help me yet again? <laughs> my pond! Oh, 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 it's happening. It's happening. Help! Please help! Wait, did she die? God damn it. God damn it. I'm stuck. I'm fucking stuck. Fuck my life. 
Que isso? Oh, what a nice lag. What a nice lag. I'm stuck! Wait. Double, you gotta double click. Come, lady. I'm stuck! Come, lady. We did it! We did it! Alright, let's go find Sickle. Oh, actually, let's get Fountain, yeah? Fountain? Um... Titan Quest 2, yeah. Exclamation point TQ2 if you're on Twitch. Got some big po po big poggies. TQ2 blog. Big poggies. Whoop. No demon. There he is. We did it. We did it. Back to the main town. We, we did it, Command. The most effective thing I've found against Nixies is a good archer build. Other builds can kill them, but they're so fast. They outrun most attacks. Yeah, I I, I don't even worry about killing them. It's, it's pretty juicy to just skip. I just skip most of the time. I sometimes, you know, you'll kill them in passing or whatever, but I just skip them. Yes, bye. Know what I mean? Know what I mean, Burn? A magical scythe! A magical scythe, you say? For me? But, but... Cast plague on them, crush them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The intruder. This is step one and two combined. See? A sacrifice. <laughs> step step one. When killing Nixies, step one. Kill other monsters. <laughs> kill other monsters. It's all your fault, buddy. Will I remember to turn in that quest? Who knows? Master Shrine. Hey, pick that up. Number one most effective way of getting rid of Nixies, ignore them. Number two most effective way, use skills that cannot be dodged, like Ring of Flame, Flame Nova, Lightning Bolt, Distort Reality, Distortion Wave, so on. Yep. Dump command. Yeah. 
The <laughs> cave dance? What's worse? Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> Uh, there's some cave dances, you know, cave entrance dancing is so, yeah. Huh. I don't know. Well, I would I would rather never have to deal... Yo, it's monster infrequent. Look at this. It just fell through the ground. See? Here it is. Uh, I would never have to do the cave dance again because... Because here's the thing. If, if Nixies exist... I could just skip them. <laughs> Whereas sometimes when you need to enter a cave, uh, you can't skip that. <laughs> However, if the options are every monster is a Nixie versus uh, remove the, the cave dance, you know, one or the other, Either you only fight Nixies, or you deal with the cave dance. I'll deal with the cave dance. <laughs> Bat thing. Uninstall Titan Quest? That's blasphemy. That's blasphemy. That is blasphemy. Not doing it. I was gonna say, does doesn't the uh, the guy with the bear usually have a thrown weapon? And this guy is not the one with the bear. That's not him. I'm an old man. Yeah, I got I got that boomer boomer memory. Last night I tried to go upwards in Hades Palace. I could not open the doors from below. Can I get out, Lord of the Rings? Just before Harry cast his lightsaber into Mount Doom to score points for Gryffindor. Uh, how many builds? Hold on, let me kill. Uh, Somebody asked uh, about builds next, um, earlier, and I, uh, forgot. Hold. Please hold. Please hold. I can hold that for you! Okay, build queue is... Uh, by the way, we're missing one build on here. I'm pretty sure there's one in between here. Um, we're we're on um, something that I deleted, and then there's another build that I deleted. So if I find that other build, uh, it's this one, then Hyles, then Redfire Elves, then your two uh, builds. So, <laughs> huh? So just so you know, I accidentally deleted one. Let me go. Let me go sell some items. So uh, soon, TM. Uh, one of your builds. Okay. Yeah. So basically, basically, I'm gonna forget all of this. Yo, wow, uh, 65 pierce damage. That's pre that's pretty good. 
cold damage too. Wow. Staff of Chosen OP. Thank you. The best storage for our hero. No, no, <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, ready for bomb pets again? God, fuck that build, dude. Holy shit. It's almost as bad as, well. This this build I'm supposed to be using monster lore. <laughs> and I refused for so long. I used it for a little bit and it's no. That's one of those builds, it's like, it's way better if you're not doing solo cell phone, like if you have uh, inheritance, or or at least, um, yeah, inheritance is, is probably the way to go. Because that's also another giant half of the game, is like, collecting really good items for builds that you haven't played yet, or are planning on playing. And then actually playing this. But I got that SSF brain rot, obviously. Brain all. My brain. My brain is broken. Nice, another Will of Ajax. Huge. Uh, HP, damage, TK. Legendary, boom, boom, hunting, storm, wisp, and monster lure. What is that, Thane? Too few builds. Uh, we got that backwards. I mean, not Thane. Uh, Sage. Yeah, Sage is fun. Sage is a really cool combo, in my opinion. Like class fantasy. It's cool. It's cool. We're talking about that a little earlier, like. What are the least or the most played combos? There are a few. Can't type says playing HC Ranger. I was wondering how much strength slash dex I need end game to equip my gear. Would like to dump some attribute points into health. Uh, well, you'll have plenty. You'll have plenty of attributes. Um, as for how much, it depends on what you're actually trying to equip. Um, Titan Quest question. Titan Quest answer. Um, and I and I'll I'll tell you this. There's like kind of three ways to think about it. Because you can respec your attributes at some point, it's it's completely fine, in my opinion, to spend points in health, even if you feel like it's maybe too much into health. Because 
because you could get minus requirements, you could get attribute scalers like uh, Hardy and um, um, like Thyphy's boots it has percent dex, and then and then like I said, minus requirement gear or artifacts or right, and then flat flat boosters on gear as well. So, in terms of spending points in health, let me just encourage you to probably just do that. As for how much, also that depends too, because some items need 500 strength, some items need, right, so on and so forth. But a good, good, good way to look at it is don't, if you're really worried about attribute points, don't spend more than 10 points per uh, difficulty on health. That's, that's, that's a kind of a good generic rule. Um, hopefully that helps. But yeah, there's lots of tools to allow you to equip things. So. Yeah, it's called, uh, it's called Potions of New Beginnings. And they only drop in the epic dungeons. So, I don't know if you know the Chaos Dungeons. They, they require keys to enter. There's only one dungeon on normal difficulty. So once you get to Epic, there are two dungeons available. And so once you grind those keys up to get inside, it's not a guaranteed drop, so you still have to, you know, farm inside the dungeons. But the mobs inside the dungeon, um, they can drop respect potions. So potion of new re new beginnings respects all your attribute points, and then there are other potions that uh, respect individual attribute points. So energy or health or right so but yeah epic difficulties when you they start dropping yes i i managed the storage on the ship but i'm starting to feel that seafaring isn't for me seafaring Have isn't seen for the storm? me still cursed rain portions of old endings yo speaking of like endings okay there's a massage place. Listen. Listen. There's a massage place at the top of my street and then like three blocks over. I don't even remember what it's called, but like it's... We have really nice storefronts and shops and everything. And then there's a random massage parlor. And ever since I've lived here, it's always like just been kind of like... I don't know. Just weird vibes, I guess. Yes, uh, last week. Last week they rate they raided the place for uh, human trafficking and like some weird behavior. Like what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you you said old endings and it, endings reminded me of ha happy endings. You know the the, the pervy saying. It's not surprising. Well, it well it is in our in our neighborhood because like we live in a pretty nice neighborhood, but like, <laughs> but still, yeah. It was like it was like it was like halfway shocking, but also kind of like weirdly validating. We we're like, I knew, <laughs> I knew the whole time, or I suspected. I suppose is the, is the better way to say it. That's because it's a, it's what you thought it was. That's because that's because he's no. I also remember when I was when <laughs> here's another here's another uh, newspaper story. When I was a, a kid growing up, I remember my best friend. Uh, well, one of my best friends. She she 
um, she was like, she was one year older than me, so in a different grade, and also went to a different school. But anyways, her, her dad was in the paper <laughs> for being arrested for, like some headline was like, uh, I can't remember what drug it was that he was selling. They were like, this man, first and last name, front, big picture of him, it said, uh, first and last name taken down for, you know, the kingpin of Akron's blah, 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 you know, whatever drug. Uh, ring. <laughs> it was like front page, and then she goes to school the next day. Holy crap! <laughs> and nobody knew. <laughs> they were like, "What the? <laughs> what the?" So I. So long story short, after when I was old enough, I moved away. I moved away. My my parents were were able to. I was like, "Hey, parents, move move out of this town." I just revealed I grew up in Ohio. Oh no! I've said I lived in Cleveland so many times. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh no! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh, my god. <laughs> oh my gosh! Do you think you I'll I'll be found out. You guys will find me. <laughs> you have no more room. Oh man. I'm just kidding. Yeah, I've 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 said I, I lived and grew up in, in Ohio many, many 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 times. Many times. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, we have two cannabis. We have can a cannabis farm three doors down from us with two giant barking dogs in it. Police raided it just before COVID, but I, but won't raid it again. Uh, they said, "How do I know it's one? All our houses consistently stink, <laughs> comings and goings." Yeah, it's just like uh, yeah. Back to my like the parlor that I was talking about. The, like the decorations are just like this. Kind of feels like a f you know a front. It doesn't feel officially like a, a massage. I go to a massage parlor after my after my um, like I participate in like runnings and uh, you know marathons every year. I don't go to that one. I go to a nice like reputable one, and like it's it's got weird decorations and everything is closed off in the front. You can't see in. Like I guess you w obviously you wouldn't want to be able to see into a massage parlor. But at least the waiting room, you know, decorate the waiting room. Or, but you can't see into anything, and so that's just like alarming. I don't know. It's just weird. <laughs> it's just weird. Um, the letterbox is sealed and the window is blacked out. Wouldn't care much if I if I like the smell, but I, it gave us constant headaches. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. How did you know? <laughs> How did you not know? <laughs> you can't hold anymore. You can't carry anymore. I don't think I can carry anymore. Maybe they have happy endings. Uh, not anymore. They got raided and shut down. Not anymore. They got deleted. Okay, boys, it's time to go. Oh my. He said, "Oh my." Did you hear? Oh my. Goodbye. You have it. You have it. Oh? Bye. Oh, it's my beer. <laughs> and my beer. My beer. Uh, how, how are you from? I'm from good. Thank you. Huh? What's happening? Huh? 
Maybe there's delay. I don't get it. I don't get it. Brain delay. PD2 season 9 in like 10 minutes. Sheesh. Nine seasons. Okay, boys. Um, I think we zip through this a little bit. Or if we're going to farm boar, maybe we don't need to. Yeah, maybe, maybe we don't need to zip through it. We'll just do it normal. Because we're going to farm the boar. To be true. Be I am at a lot. Yes. Yes. Yeah, we'll just go kill the boar. Life is, Life is tough. Welcome, stranger. Look at our shop. My father is the best smith in town. You'll find wow, no Griffin and place. Pegasus in the same vendor. <laughs> That's crazy. Thank you. <laughs> yes. Yes. Okay, did I have another stew? I do have another Ajax. That's nice. Yeah, I don't have Lupine Claws anyways. We only have one. The Teutons are planning to move south. I should go with them. Oh, sweet sheepy. Where's the sheepy at? Gazel! Let's go, sheepy. Let's go, sheepy. Big, big frozen. Big frozen again. I hate, I hate this spawn so much. Titan Quest has been on a mean streak, farming SBCs, and it's trying to get into Fort Knox. Oh no. oh no! Oh no! People are struggling with the stone binders. We love the stone binders. posted the other day uh, this here hail mighty he's no <laughs> I made me laugh so hard <laughs> hail mighty he's no <laughs> hail 
Almighty is new. Hail, warrior! That's good. Who's your epic is new? <laughs> I am Iznu. Why? Why is why is Iznu so mighty? Have you seen Iznu? <laughs> That's so stupid. Pew, 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 pew. He did. He did. He did. Oh, one lag, please. Yo, actually, is is uh, is Mama on right now? Is Mama on? Uh, Mama, go oh, Mama live. He no live. Who's your epic Mama? Oh, he's done. Oh no. I missed it. What did you do today? What did What did Mama do today? Oh, he played Diablo 3. Good old Diablo. Dibble dabble diblo. Yo, that's a big pointer. That's, that's one big pointer. I was hoping he would play more uh, uh, cursed challenge. More cursed. Oh, oh, oh. That's big damage. I got the hiccups. Uh, when will I play Diablo 4? Um, well, I'm definitely going to play season, the next season, which is May 18th, May something. In May, not till May. I don't think I'll stream it though. <laughs> uh, if I play Diablo 4, everyone leaves. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I played I played WoW on stream a couple times. That's a stream killer. Diablo is a stream killer. Uh what else is a stream killer? Just anything that's not Titan Quest basically. <laughs> it's okay. Huh? Seven skill points? Huh? Where have I been? Let's get eruption. Obviously. Easy. Did I play do I play Dra Dragon's Dogma? Yeah, yeah. Uh I've almost finished one playthrough. Uh I haven't finished the guy that I streamed. Because I had I had a couple characters going just to try out what it felt like to level with um, some early um, some early vocations. What are they called? Yeah. But yeah, so one of my playthroughs is almost done, and uh, it's it dude, it's dope. I, I love that game. Get erupted! Get erupted! Wow. 
Was that treachery? Yeah, tre treacherous. What about Doki Doki Literature Club? <laughs> yeah. Uh, the people that I would attract to the stream. I need to. I need to stop my joke right now. My joke needs to, to stop. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> no, I won't play that game. Big mistake. Huh? Uh, Scandia. Huh? What do you have there? This is locked. Oh. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I forgot. Uh, I meant I meant to come back for the scarf and nothing else. <laughs> the scarf. The scarf. Playing through Skyrim. Pog. I mean, uh, Morrowind. I didn't mean to say Skyrim. Sorry. Trigger word. Book equals dead trees. Siren equals woman. Uh, I won't lie, we're kind of getting a lot of monster frequency. Yeah, I play, um... In the evenings on Sunday, I'm playing. I'm still playing Baldur's Gate Three. This is our third playthrough, and we play four-player co-op. It's pretty dope. And Mondays, I hang out with a dude and I, uh, a buddy IRL, and uh, we play. Right now, we're playing Revenant from the Ashes, the uh, the sequel or whatever. Remnant 2. Another troll sticker. Look at that. Look at I'm that. I'm actually very hard. That thing's pretty good. 16%. Oh, this, this rolled trickery. Attack speed and dodge. Yeah. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. First decade of 2000 had so many great games. Yep, it's true. Also, it's like, it's like, it's not even nostalgia. It's like, um, it's not nostalgia for the right reasons. Like, early 2000s for me, I had a lot of time. And so a lot of greatness came out. And I had a lot of time to enjoy the greatness. There's still, there's still good games that come out. One, they're very different. They're very different types of great games that come out. And two, I have very limited free time to enjoy the very different great games. So it just feels, it's just a lot different. Yeah, it's just a lot different. I used Thunderstorm Scroll on Hades. Uh, when he turned into a ghost, it ran out before the ghost was dead, but did pretty good damage. Excellent. Ah! 
I think post 2015 has been utter trash. I don't, I don't know if I agree with that, but I mean I don't understand what you're saying. Hey, like Boulder's Gate three. <laughs> Doki Doki Literature Club. Hello. You have no more room. I have no more room. <laughs> Doki Doki is good. <laughs> Doki Doki is goaded. That's right, boys. If I get a good staff, I'm gonna be sad. You have traveled to many. Most of the what? What did it give me? What did it give me? Well, I'm missing one. <laughs> I miss. <laughs> I'm missing one. Where's the third one? How did I miss that? <laughs> How did I miss that? Oh my gosh. Huh? How did I miss that? Helmets are over here. Tangled hair, but no split skull. Okay, one is in the cave. Wait, one is in the cave. Two is in the other cave. Three is in the other cave. I don't remember where the fourth, the third one is. Like in the mountains, like the Scandia coast. Three, number three is what I missed. Yeah, Fafnir Cave, Tomb Here, and the Cave Before Hilda's Vinny. Did I miss? Wait, the yeah, the breast. Yeah, okay. Let me go. Let me go back. Yeah, maybe I missed that. Come back soon. Yeah, maybe maybe I missed that. Because I thought the breast there was the breastplate. No, the breastplate is in these tombs. Is there? Is there one? Is there one in the in here? Yeah, there is. Yeah, it's in the box. No, you're right. You're right. <laughs> I think that's that's probably yes. the one I missed. Yeah. Yeah. So this would be three. Yeah, exactly. This this is number three. And I think it's this one maybe. I don't remember which one it is. Yeah, it's this one. I didn't even come in here. <laughs> nice. First time playing. First time playing. Did it, boys. Yeah, all that for yeah. No, it's for the XP. <laughs> you guys know how I feel about XP. <laughs> you have brought me, dude. I every time, every time you get, every time you don't need a good staff, you get a good staff. <laughs> That's so stupid, man. Sharp as a razor. <laughs> Shut up, stupid kid. Slay some trolls for me, will you? <laughs> I 
Hi, long time chatter, first time viewer. How is TQ and how does it compare to its superior sequel, Grim Dawn? Do I buy the expansions? Is the game worth it or should I just join the Wilson van? Yes. Shut the fuck up, Ocelot. I swear to God. How dare you kill my boar and desecrate it. I got stunned. Not good. If only I had monster... Whoa, huh? Monster lure. Wow, look at this. Two, two monster infrequence. Look at that. B -b 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 Bracers and chest. Here's my bleed res and less damage from giants. Okay, am I gonna go far? Am I gonna farm the bo the boar? You guys ready to farm the boar? <laughs> Sorry, but this is ridiculous. Yes. 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 The boat, the boat, the boat, the boat. A spear? No, I would guess all I... There is a small... The boat, 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 to the dark lands. Shut the fuck up, adios. Okay, let's turn on... Counter... Boar. We did not kill him 50 times yet, but we will. We did not kill him nine times. Huh? What is this counter? There we go. We killed him one time. That's fair, right? Hey. The boat. The boat. One quick kill. What's the insulation roll here? Uh, huh? Am I blind? In I I saw insulation insulated of unhindered. Am I drunk? Oh, here it is. It's uh, it's uh, intelligence rip, rip. But the insulation is cold res. Um, what do I think of this build with a bow? Let me check. Let me plug in my internet cable. Uh, I would drop, I would drop to one point, maybe a couple, just, maybe just a couple here. Let, let this be passive and then pick up this. Uh, just let this, you know, just pick this up. The reason you always want this, if you're going to use the base, is because it reduces the charge level at plus four.
to where this procs every other damage, uh, every other attack. So, so you just always want this. Um, you can't use Phantom Strike with a bow, so you could save points here. I mean, you could you know you, know, you could swap button I guess and use your weapon, but you can't. Yeah, you can't use Phantom Strike. So a pretty good debuff is just casting um, this from time to time. Um, it's not necessary, but you know, whatever. You can save some points that way. Um, you could also save points by just one pointing this. It's uh, you know completely up to you, but just you only really need to one point this for the fifteen percent element, uh, fifteen percent um, fizz res. If you want more points, that's fine. Um, so here, this brings that character down to level sixty-eight, and then. I guess, I guess technically 58 with all the skill points. Uh, yeah. Let me see. What else? I will say if you, if you want to try out Trance of Empathy, this b playing with a bow in Trance of Empathy is actually pretty cool. Uh, Convalescence I do recommend though. Let me see what else. I would consider actually getting Nightmare just for um, just for um, hip hypnotic gaze it's for some RR. But again, you don't you probably don't need it until Legendary, and there's other tools too. But yeah, you know this this is great. There's lots of power. Yeah, lots of power. Um. This is this is a bit overkill in my opinion. If you need the armor and the fire res, yeah, feel free. Absolutely. It's it's free armor, it's free fire res. But I tend I tend to, you know, you just usually don't need that. So yeah, you can save points all over the place. But yeah, this is it's pretty good. Would this build have enough attack speed? Well, with this total speed here, this is really the only speed um that you have within the mastery the rest of your attack speed is going to have to come from gear um, yeah you you'll you'll likely never get close to cap or you'll get nowhere near cap with just masteries so like there's a, there's a few things that can give you total speed like cooldowns from masteries and things like that. Um, Rally has total speed that that sort of stuff. But all your all your attack speed is going to come, all your meaningful attack speed is going to come from gear and such. So, just be aware of that. Uh, yeah, this is good though. I mean, this is this is a lot of fun. I, Psionic beam actually is a lot of it's a lot of fun with bows. It's a lot of fun with bows. Uh, is this global armor? This is global armor, yes. So every piece would get 45 armor. Yeah. So in that regard, it is. It's fine, but just, in my opinion, probably not worth, you know, 10 points early on, right? So it, but yeah, but the, generally speaking, but yeah, what you linked is pretty good. Uh, okay. We go again. I'm sleepy. Holy smokes. Holy smokes. Yeah, both those master both those masteries are pretty easy to level too. Which is nice. That always feels good. Any bows? So yeah, Eldritch Bow in Act 2 if you want to farm Dune Raiders. Um, if you're looking for unique bows, it's a bit more complicated. Uh, for your particular mastery, you, you can stack physical damage. You could stack um, uh, vitality damage on a bow. You could stack piercing damage. You could stack fire damage. So there's lots. Horrible build because zero points in dream image and meteor shower. No, it's a great build. Perfect build. 
Um, I do recommend, I do just generally recommend until you get late game. Uh, so, Brigands mode, I'll just bring this up. Brig, Brig, and, oh, so I'm not on Bose. Brig. I'll just show, I'll just show you this. This is a le level, level two requirement. <laughs> 20% attack speed. Don't don't farm for it. But it does exist. Don't farm for it. The this is from Act 1. Um Eldritch Bow is from Act 2. And that requires level 13 with 20% attack speed. Um and it's only slow instead of very slow. Lots of bows are very slow. Um so you you could farm this. This only drops from Dune Raiders. Right? That's why we farm Ease New from time to time. Um, moving into Act 3, there's not really an Act 3 monster and frequent I would recommend. But moving to Act 4, you could uh, you could definitely get to Bramble. Right? You can get Bramble Bow, and that requires level 26. Attack speed and chance of reduced uh, resistances, right? Th those are the kind of the generic go-to. There's pl there's tons of uniques. There are tons of uniques, you know. So. Um, Wings of Isis. Yeah, I mean, we could sh we could show that, sure. Let me show you Wings. I mean, this is insane, obviously. Right? It's got some recharge, increased projectile speed. There's no... The thing that's interesting about this is it has no piercing ratio. So, th that kind of stat is really cool because... Um, lots of bows split damage because of ratio. And in this case, you will you will simply be applying this physical damage... Uh, total damage and flat piercing damage, right? Not, not, nothing is uh, converted. And because it's all physical damage, when it's converted down here, it becomes elemental, right? So you're juicing out fire damage. Well, you know, one third fire damage, right? So I don't know if I actually recommend this bow for this build, but it is good. Yeah, it is good. So then it gives you wild wildfire. If you don't know what wildfire is, it's the same animation as core dwellers like a um, AOE. There's a and there's a a thrown weapon called uh, flakes of Mus Muspelheim. When you attack, it also does the same thing. It's pretty strong. It's pretty cool. So. Has no pierce due to elemental conversion. Yeah, well, that, yeah, yeah. You you answered before I was finished talking, yeah. Yeah. Just a teaching opportunity. The, the reason I don't know if I would recommend this, it's great, don't get me wrong. I It's great. Uh, the reason I don't think I would recommend this bow particularly is probably lots of farming. Um... And because it's elemental, and between this particular build, hold on, where's it at? Where are we? This particular build only boosts fire damage, um, and and uh, and Dream Mastery focuses on fizz and vitality damage. In addition, I would I would probably lean towards just something else. Yeah. So it, I'm not saying it's bad. It's definitely good. But there's, there's just I would just take some time and and look at um, the bow section if I were you, and figure out where they come from and such. So, but yeah, remember attack speed feels really, really, really good. So if you can get attack speed on bows, um, that's nice. But also, attack speed exists elsewhere too. So yeah, that's a pretty good build.
That's your favorite bow if you combine it with earth and fire masteries. Become a killer unit. Hello? Another Bear Riders. That's pretty crazy. That's one big kill. Let me actually sell gold or sell items and pick up uh, pick up some pots. Finally, the market is busy again. Almost too busy. A cart nearly rammed into my stall. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? I can't believe it. Yo, also, we have uh, seven million gold. Do we do a quick gambit? Yo, Hardy of Survival. Sheesh. If only that was Hail of Survival. That would be really pog. Hey, Hermes guide your way. Gamba. God bless TQ players. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah, we, lo we love Titan Quest. We love Titan Quest. Yeah, thanks for hanging out. Keep, keep gaming. Hold on, Adios. Let me let me gamble. Then we'll make fun of. You can't win if you don't play. Uh, seven seven Orbeez. Is open. Seven Orbeez incoming. Good luck. Not a single effing item. <laughs> wow. Wow. That's depressing. Wow, insulated of Tinkerer though. That's pretty good. Fire res plus uh, Tinkerer. <laughs> That's big depression, guys. Holy crap. Holy crap. No combat feeling. You'll be back. You can't carry anymore. Your inventory you can't is hold full. Anymore. Hmm. Fine weapons. Look at them. The best. What? Veterans bow. I got really excited. Veterans big affix. Hmm? Hmm? Uh, what I would recommend, though, actually, is a murder like a veteran's bow of Tinkerer on legendary difficulty. Just get that, and you don't need literally anything else. Just sl there's there's probably not a bow for for attack speed purposes that's going to be better than that. Um, back to the bow discussion. Check back next week. But uh, good luck. It's all. Don't be a stranger. God, Godspeed, my friend. Bow and arrow. What else? Wow, flat dexterity. Okay. Enjoy. Okay, did I kill pig? Yeah, I did. Another one. Not a single minute to regret, hell yeah. A little bottle of water. <laughs> Hold on. Shut up, Titan Quest. <laughs> <laughs> A little bottle of water. A little bottle of water. A little bottle of water. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's perfect. It's perfect. 
<laughs> oh, it's good. I love it. Oh, nice. Vest of America. It's intelligence. We're getting the blues, boys. I got the blues. Let me go again. How would you make hunting and storm work? Casting uh, and bowing does bow does not seem to work properly. Any thoughts on these two? Yeah, so, I mean, you just focus on flat damage. Like, flat lightning and cold damage on bow. Um... Yeah, that that's basically what I would do. I mean, you could do other things too, for sure. So like, so like, uh, you could also you could also um, do a spear, right? Because because hunting. Let me let me just. Sh I'm sure you know this, but like prefix um, or a suffix tinkerer, right? You get a you get a you get a spear with tinkerer and then just looking at just looking at this tree um sage right spears so we're going to focus on wood lore wood lore gives attack speed for you know bow, bows and spears spear dance is incredible aoe it's incredible aoe so so now just think about buffing your weapon right with lightning damage and cold damage and and uh, lightning scaler and then get wisp plus uh elemental damages right uh you you don't honestly you don't even need squall i know that's blasphemy i know it's blasphemy because study prey is probably mechanically easier um but it's up to the player and then so also you've got takedown for gap closer. If you don't want to use takedown, you also have lightning dash as your left click replacer. Like it's incredible. Like this actually is a really incredible. Same thing also, by the way, lightning dash um, because of the 10 lightning damage. Um, it's Toxic. actually good. Toxic so uh, but yeah, bows, bows fine too. I'm just illustrating something else that you could do with hunting. Yeah. So, and then still, you you want to live inside of Call of the Hunt for the attack speed. You're getting bonus damage to beastmen and animals. Now everybody sees bleed damage and they think, oh, I got to stack decks. But no, not really. Just let it be passive. Uh, in this scenario, we have spear, so we're juicing out uh, piercing and bleed damage. Or you could just one point that and actually take advantage of uh, offensive ability. Right, and now you're critting whenever you're, you know, hitting with spear. So that is a very easy, um, easy kind of possibility. Same thing with um, you have a couple other spells when the, when lightning bolt is available, just use it. Right, the wisp himself has plenty of damage. Now, since we talked about a tinkerer, um, a tinkerer, did I bring bring this up? I didn't bring it up. But so but since we talked about tinkerer stuff, what you're going to want to do is for this spear, you can go what is the dreadful Atlantis charm? Uh hold. I can't remember the name of it. But there's there's plenty of options to be completely honest with you. Um th this is Poseidon's trident. This is arm, armor only. This is percentage lightning damage, right? You put that on your bracers. Um, for weapons, we want to look at things like either total damage. This is pretty nice, truthfully. So, and then you also have chill of Tartarus. This is flat cold damage, right? And if you're giga lucky... You can get either another, you can get elemental damage, you can get more flat cold damage, you can get percentage cold damage, 
Or, this is also one of my favorite, you could get Dreadful Completion Bonus. This completion bonus here, even though the values are low, you're scaling two of those damage types, right? So, so, so think about Chill of Tartarus plus, um, plus like an attack speed. So then we're looking at uh, Achilles. Uh, so then we're looking at, uh, I, even though it's fat, flat physical damage and then attack speed, then you the force completion bonus is more attack speed. So that's your first one, and then another damage type is your second one, or you could double up on attack speed. Nothing wrong with that, but like, but there's there's plenty of possibilities, especially because Storm Mastery um, has a weapon buff. You're just gonna imbue your weapon with something, right? So just use your weapon. <laughs> uh, do elemental damage from spells actually have a tiny percentage increase from intelligence? Yeah, 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 and you can see the you can see the the ratio here. So when you go to your third tab, when you see when you go to your third tab, you can see here I have five percent lightning damage somewhere. I have no idea. <laughs> and so the the glow the multiplier for int uh, gets multiplied by one one point two seven uh, of my intelligence, right? And so that is every 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 source of um lightning damage right is multiplied it gets affected by your intelligence so basically yes um yeah five percent from hades yeah thanks yeah yeah good memory thank you so anyways just just uh there's so many possibilities and like i i'm a creature of habit myself but one of the best things about Titan Quest is just trying a couple of damage types, even even if you only think your mastery um, supports you know one or two. Sometimes trying multiple damage types is like actually really cool, or just trying different mechanics. It, it feels really powerful because it's so versatile. Uh, you could also get, you can also get, um, what's the, what's the eider? Oh, it's a charm. Right, you can get eider, which is flat elemental damage and, and conversion of uh, weapon damage. If you're, if you're god tier, you get attack speed, right? And this goes on rings and amulets. <laughs> So that I mean that's huge. That's huge. Get some tanker or rings or something. All right, not to mention there's plenty of other items in the game that start converting your weapon as well. So you have plenty of options. I don't know, does that help? Does that make sense? Does that expand your brain? -al? Or hide. Okay, I seem to have a poo poo seed. It's time for alt, alt. It's time for alt F four. Is it time to spin the wheel? Jesus. Did you guys see how low my health got? I need to stop fighting these. Uh... 
Uh, cr it cr crashes around the same spot and I can't progress. Oh, uh, dude, it's the worst. Uh, corrupted characters feel so bad. It's the worst. Have you tried, like, um... Have you tried, like, opening it in Vault? Sometimes that'll, like, actually solve it. Psionic versus Turnian, which one do I prefer? Uh, okay, since you said which one do I prefer, I prefer, um, both. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I actually prefer turning an attack. There, are, <laughs> there's a pitfall for turning an attack, which is it's bad until until you get it maxed out, right? So you transition from something, dump all your points into it instead of use it to level. Um, you know, obviously, uh, psionic beam. You know, psionic touch is a bit more single tar target oriented, where turning an attack inherently is, you know, multi target or cleave. So, in in that regards, I I I prefer turning an attack. But if we're talking about which one's better, you know, that's that de it just depends, you know. You weren't out of normal. Oh, okay, good. Yeah. Dude, sorry, Kaz. That feels bad. Sorry, homie. I've only had a few corrupted characters, which is a few too many. <laughs> oh, you rolled Guardian? Oh, hell yeah, dude. You got easy mode. You got easy mode, man. Is that exciting for you? Wait. Sometimes there's nothing better than like starting a build that's that's exciting. But the only thing actually the only thing that's better is starting a build that you don't think's going to be good and it turns out to be real pog. That's what's really exciting. I think that's really exciting. Oops, I hit SPCs. Okay, let's let me get a let me get a new seed. Guys, give me one second. I need to use the restroom. I'm sorry. Uh but we're going to load up and kill some more pigs. Let's kill some more pigs. Give me one second, guys. Be right back.
I have returned. I have returned. I'm ready to kill some pigs. Princess will come you. It would be a blast to be able to have mercenaries from different uh, towns like in D2. Yeah, I don't know. That that could be interesting. I think um, we because we talked about like the like what what we might get with pets and such. Um, uh, you know, anything's possible, especially with a new game. And like when we start to think about they're they're probably gonna tell. Um, there's probably going to be slightly more focus on the presentation of a story. And so within the realm of the story, I certainly see maybe someone following you, you know, part, part, you know, part, part of the campaign, right? Cause like in act four, you have to protect the torch guy. You know, there's all kinds of quests kind of like that. You got to go save villagers in act four, stuff like that. And so, like, the idea of during the campaign, somebody following you. I don't know if that's inherently Titan Quest, though, of, like, a full-on mercenary system. Um, who knows? Yeah, who, who, who knows, to be honest with you. I do quite like the idea of, like, summons coming back, pets coming back, um... And like any kind of combination, I, I I quite like that, and I I am excited to see kind of like what they do with that. A small Yeti summon. Yeah. My, I suspect I, I I should backtrack a little bit. I I suspect that we'll have something really interesting with the mount. Right, Orion or whatever, you know, or Pegasus or Mount, whatever. And I bet you we won't have something as robust as the mercenary system. I could be wrong. I, you know, I don't know. I have no idea. All that I hope is that if there's formulas that return, please return. That that would be great. That they go into a book instead of our inventory. And the book... I don't think I want the book to be account bound. But if it is, I think it would be interesting. But man, let me tell you. Finding m many, many copies of the same artifact. And then it taking up inventory space. Woof. Woof. Sakellis' so arm guards. By the way, if you're not using Stonebinder's cuffs, and I would argue that at some point when you get something like this, it's okay not to. Th th these, these gloves are incredible. These are, are incredible. Incredible. I'm not going to use them, though. <laughs> Hello, gamer. Hello, uh, Staculata. Happy Friday. Happy Friday, gamers. Hello, YouTube. We've got some YouTubers here today. Hello, YouTube. A volcanic take shuttle bodies. 
Uh, so, hold on, let me let me kill this. I don't want to die. Uh, I will read that. Yeah. By the way, when we talk about Titan Quest Two, I use a lot of Titan Quest One, um, like terminology, just to reference mechanics that we could have. I, I don't know anything about Titan Quest Two. I I don't. Nothing. I know nothing. Um, Smith, oh wait, Smith instead of formulas, Smith can craft more, yeah, right, an NPC, yeah, exactly. Smith can craft some more or less basic things like weapons and some small artifacts, um, amulet, armor, and you can find some better formulas for monsters. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I like that. Yeah, I like that idea. I like the idea of a service being provided by an NPC because it makes the world, um... You, the Gambler is the best example. That's one of my favorite dudes to go click on because I could be getting something cool, right? So more NPCs that could give us stuff is, I, I think, is great. Uh, I know that it's coming, yes. What's my favorite way of playing? What build and what mastery? Um, my favorite way of playing is is solo self found and hardcore um but my I, that's an impossible question for me to answer i i don't know what i like best truthfully i don't know what i like best and, and that's really 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 hard because <laughs> i like them all <laughs> um but i will at least i, I can at least answer half the question like uh, i really enjoy playing from level one playing with zero inheritance you know finding all the gear myself I find lots of pleasure doing that. Favorite mastery. I don't. I, favorite mastery combos, man. I, I I just don't know. I don't think I can. I don't think I can pick two. Craft a random weapon. Hmm. TQ's flaw IMO is the lack of randomness in environments and mob encounters. I don't think so. I don't think um, there's a handcrafted world, so you're not going to get random tile sets. There will be randomness in mob encounters. Um, even if it's only the same same, same way that Titan Quest 1 does it, right? There could be a... In every pack, there could be a hero monster, right? Toxeus could spawn, Dactyl could spawn, that, that sort of randomness. But I suspect you're probably wanting something a bit more along the lines of... I don't know, PoE randomness you know poe mob design i don't think that's going to happen but who knows we don't know templar is your favorite well i don't get many visitors uh hello asgardian 2251 2,251 of you it came before. Uh, hello, sir. If by randomness you mean something like paths in Grim Dawn, where sometimes you can go through a path, but sometimes A is blocked and you have to go to B, no thank you. Yeah, I think that's... Well, I don't get many visitors. I think that's also something I don't want. What, one thing I dislike, and I, I, I'm not hating on Grim Dawn, I promise. One thing I hate, I dislike about Grim Dawn is... The narrow path design, they have lots of paths, but it seems like they went very narrow. Maybe I'm wrong, right? Maybe I'm like misremembering, but it feels like lots of paths are very narrow. And then the randomness of blocked paths, I think is <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> I, honestly, I honestly think that's really stupid. Um. But I do like, I do like 
just about everything else from Grimdon, to be honest with you. Um, I, I think I think certain outdoor environments of Grimdon, the the way they're designed, are a bit fresher or a bit more modern feeling, obviously, than Titan Quest. Um, we only hate on Grimdon here, yeah. <laughs> I was thinking of Diablo 3 where you can do Leoric Dungeon continually because of the level generation. Yeah, I that's not going to be in... I, I I sincerely, sincerely doubt that that's, that's going to be in Titan Quest 2. Yeah, it's just not. I mean, they've already said on their... On their um, I could be wrong. Look, I could be wrong. But they've already said on their Steam page that they're, they have a handcrafted world. Right? And there's, you know, they implied that, like, no randomness in the layouts, that kind of thing. There's islands or land to which you can go through a skinny path, which is weird. Yeah, yeah, exactly. My, my, the first thing that comes to mind, there's, I'm sure there's more, but, like, Act 2. Act 2 in, um, in Grim Dawn, where it's like you're standing up on these, like, tiny stone ledges... And they weave around underneath. Like, it's just weird. It's just weird design. It's just weird design. And it makes... I think of that because... I feel like in Titan Quest, mobs can be very dangerous. And if you're standing in a nar narrow corridor... Right? That's scary. But in Grim Dawn... You just push a, sk a one button and things blow up. <laughs> so it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Yeah, I think I think um I think Grim Dawn does a lot of things with the world pretty interesting. The only thing I don't like is just the the darkness, the 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 grim nature of it, and it's like aesthetics. So that's completely subjective. The design-wise, most of the levels are pretty good, honestly. TQ does not have trash mobs, or yeah, it's like it's like it's significantly less, right? Yeah. And then also other factors, like it's it's very important to gear properly in Titan Quest, whereas the and that means lots of things. Sometimes swap gear is required, you know. Sometimes, and then in Grim Dawn, it is also important to gear properly. But because of the amount of loot that it gives you, and the o the only thing you need to really do while leveling is cap certain resists, and because capping resists is insanely easy, it's just it's just not difficult <laughs> until later, you know. Yeah, I don't know. It's just, it's just different games, basically. Just different games. I love an ARPGs where the regular monsters could mess you up. Yeah, TQ and Sacred. If you don't have enough damage or defense, you're going to get killed. Yeah. Yeah, it's true. Do I play with X-Max? I used to from time to time, but not, I not really anymore. And I used to only do it just to test out builds. I, I think, but I think playing with X Max it gets you in the habit of one. You know, like there's things that the the game that that the mod changed that is unofficial. It's like you know, it breaks the game a little bit. Like, it changed spells, it changed uh, cooldowns of certain things. And it is challenging. It's very challenging. But... Yeah, it's just not my cup of tea, I guess. Right? I don't, I don't, I don't know how else to explain it.
I do really like curses, by the way. I do really like curses. Um, I think that's a better challenge than X Max, in my opinion, because it's let's flex. Because it's it recognizes that monsters, the way they spawn should be difficult, not the number of monsters. I don't know if that makes sense, right? So X Max, you're like, okay, I can handle tons and tons of mobs. You know, give me more. Uh, where curses goes the other way, you have the same amount of monsters. They they're just harder because you have less resist. I think I I think I like that challenge more than you know three times the monsters. Does that make sense? Because also when you fight three times the monsters, what happens is you also get three times the XP, which they mitigated a little bit. You also get three times the gold. You get three times the charm drop, and you get three times the um, gear drop. So I think. I think making, keeping, I think keeping the density the same, but making those, the, that density harder is, is a better challenge for my brain. Right? Yeah, monster strength, strength versus density is what I mean. Yeah, exactly. Uh, X Max, most versions of X Max changes how quickly plague spreads and how quickly it ticks. It changes um, the, the animation and the length of flame surge um it changes there's three other spells that it changes to um and it's all it's all in the text notes that nobody reads <laughs> but um yeah so it so it, it adjusts things so so people get used to certain you know a way certain things behave in x max and then you know you just assume it's the it's the base game Yeah, there's there's two other there's two other spells I know for a fact it changes. Um, X Max is imbalanced. Yeah, it it is. And Poe players specifically craft that mod on maps. Yeah, it, well, yeah, that makes sense in Poe. Like it's you know that's fine there. But yeah. Also, two I know two or three of the versions of X Max. Uh, increases um, Atlantis loot drop because that was it was built and tuned around when Atlantis had bad drops or you know imbalanced um, drops and they did because they didn't fix the Atlantis you know problems until <laughs> Eternal Embers support rip. But anyways, just there's just it's, if you ever if you ever get bored, actually read Pat, the uh, X Max change uh, change log. Of whatever version you're using. I, I know one of them changes the squall, also the squall tick rate. Uh, hella funny and satisfying to smash shaders in Act 1, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I recommend if you're gonna go mod, if you're if you're gonna mod something, I actually recommend Soul Vizier, um, because it's I don't even want to talk about balance, but it is a it is a total conversion. It's a total like a complete mod, right? And instead of like, it's like a whole new game to play, basically. Uh, and they do th they do things in this old Vizier mod that multiplies um, pack size and stuff. It's pretty cool. All right, adios. I think I actually am probably gonna stop at like thirty kills, maybe fifty kills, because I I do want to get to epic. We could also farm Talos on epic. Which basically has the same drop tables, and I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure Talos no, has no. this bow. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh,
Bow of the Nymph. Yeah, we, yeah, we can get it from Talos as well, right? So, I think that would be slightly better use of my time. Not like stop farming altogether. I just mean farm something else. I disagree. Uh, how would I rate the the Nadan mastery? I find it to be quite disappointing and not on par with others. Um, I think it's a very versatile mastery. It's not overpowered in like a damaging dealing uh, compartment. That's why I think a lot of people dislike it. Also, a lot of people dislike it because of the gameplay loop of there's an expensive buff that costs a lot of energy but is very worth it to apply so it drains that energy and then there's other potion drinking uh, buffs that when you drink an energy potion or a health potion to maintain your health or your, your buff upness you get more buff right so people don't like that play, that gameplay loop and I get it but I think it's very versatile because of consequences. I think it's insanely versatile because it has pets. Um, I think it's insanely versatile because it has a very big damage cooldown. Uh, but the most most importantly, it's just so durable. It's just so durable. It has Dragon's Breath, which has insane fumble. It has Shen Pao, which is very powerful um, uh, potion, you know, elemental damage. I would say it's... It's probably definitely... I think it fits very well, honestly. I don't know if I would say it's overpowered. It's very... It's very... It's very strong in terms of defensiveness. Yeah. But I don't... I don't, th I don't think it's... I don't think it's bad. That's for sure. I think it's very... I think it's very... I think it's very in line. A lot of the things actually that Eternal Embers added is quite strong, it's quite overtuned, but the mastery itself I don't think is overtuned. Like the cha the chaos dungeons, the uh, charms that you get out of those dungeons. There's like a there's like a a hat charm and a, a bracer charm. Those two charms, because you can get them on normal difficulty or, you know, at level 60, they're just absolutely insane. That doesn't, I guess that doesn't even require Eternal Embers either. Ease new is overtuned. Dream Mastery was OP. Uh, how would I combine it with, with others? Well, uh, let me let me just pull up the calculator and I'll I'll kind of just describe. It sounds like you don't you aren't familiar with the master mastery. So let's let's start from the beginning and let's get familiar with it. Um because because it's Titan Quest, it just depends, you know. Now, th this this calculator is a little out of uh, out of sorts, but we can still use it for illustration, right? Because um, the uh, the pets are over here in the in, in game. But the buff, the main buff that everyone wants is twelve out of twelve aura of tranquility gives you twenty seven fizz res, twenty seven element elemental res, and twenty seven percent damage absorption. 27% damage absorption. Now, in order to maintain that, that costs 12 energy per second, right? So that's expensive. Okay, so you're drinking blue pots. Well, fear not. If you drink a potion, you have health regen, right? 
and energy regen. If you drink a potion, you get this health and energy regen plus poison life and bleed res, right? And then up here, if you drink a potion, you have a chance for Eternal Embers potions to proc, right? These, these Eternal Embers potions are insane. Okay, now that's just, that's just layers of defense. You've got, you've also have Smoke Cloud, which is chance to stun or immobilization, and it's a giant AoE. It's an offensive ability, right? Every offensive ability procs consequences. It is the, this consequences is the easiest re reduction of resistance to just get because it's so low in the mastery, right? It's insanely low, right? So seven seconds duration, minus 25% resist, and when you kill somebody, it spreads, right? Um, okay, so I think you're starting to get the idea. Then the top of the mastery, right? 12 out of 12. We're not even talking about plus the skills. 12 out of 12. This is a buff. It's an aura that your player emanates. So if you're combining it with other pet masteries or other multiplayer sessions, you're giving this to your allies, right? And what it does, every auto attack or, um, you know, every attack gives 140 vitality damage, uh, 27 reduced damage for three seconds, 27% reduced resistances for three seconds, right? That is insane. That is insane. Okay, we haven't even talked about really offensive abilities yet. Uh, Shen Pao um, will always roll one of three elemental damages, fire, cold, or lightning, and it always rolls right around 300 points of damage. It's in a, it's in a radius, so it's an AoE. Uh, you have a reduction enemy health as well. You have impaired aim and slower movement for two seconds. And then if you kill somebody... It explodes in a fire damage AoE, a cold damage AoE, or a lightning damage AoE, depending on what element that it procs. Um, so there's some. So you've got elemental damage, right? Um, your auto attack, your your auto attack replacer. Um, this works similar to onslaught, or uh, sorry, similar to um, psionic beam, psionic touch. So every other hit, you get this fifty nine percent damage proc. And every hit, you have a chance. You have a fifty percent chance to proc lightning damage. So here we're doing lightning element, um, lightning damage on our auto attack. And then at the very, very top, it has an arc. So it's kind of like a cleave. Um, when it, you know, when it procs, you you cleave, right? So it's your auto attack replacer. All this stuff can apply consequences. You also have breath attack. Now, this isn't going to do a ton of damage, but what it does, it does a little bit of burn, a little bit of poison. What it does, 63% chance to fumble and 63% chance to fear or confusion. The fumble is massive. It's absolutely massive. Um, sa same thing at the top. It's not going to do a lot of damage, but you can actually scale it a little bit. This is 285 elemental damage. So... How I'll put it to you, how would you combine it with other things? There's so many possibilities. <laughs> There's so many possibilities. Yeah. Yeah. Uh oh, also the biggest biggest level in the game, biggest skill in the game, five percent chance eight out of eight to proc extra gold when you kill monsters. Big gold. Oh, I didn't even talk about um, chi realignment. Chi realignment. I don't. I don't actually really recommend. But you, it, this is a way to try to maintain your energy. And I think this is maybe a failed attempt. But if you're doing an energy, um, like energy ratio kind of build, where you're trying to deal damage by leeching energy or doing energy drain, this is. There's a spell that now supports it. Um, so it does leech. It does 58% energy drain, and then that conversion part that I'm talking about, when you drain energy, 250% uh, of that energy is dealt as damage as well. Interesting. It's, it's not the best, though. Uh, also, you, the add-on does more frost burn, uh, does skill disruption, and slowed, and bonus damage to ghosts. So I would never really play around with this, but it's, it's fine. Uh, really, 
the aura of tranquility and the consequences alone just makes this combine with anything that is like little um, weak or missing um, easy re reduction resistance. You just combine it with, um, just combine it with, you know, consequences. Pet army with nature. Yeah, just I actually just played through as a hermit, right? Yeah. Hermit is uh, Nadan in nature. Yep. It's pretty big. Yeah, when you when you pop when you pop Weka Chakra, your every pet that you have de deals uh this 140 vitality damage. Um right? It's insane. Yeah, there's there's so many ways to play with um Shen Pao or uh Nate Nate and Mastery. It's it's really, really strong. It's really, really strong. Yeah, even even just the even just relying on the um potion procs makes your build pretty strong. Um, oh yeah. What's that? Uh, a monk? Hey Dan, let's defense his monk. Uh, Contemplator is also unkillable. Contemplator is dream in Nadan. Trance of Convalescence also has damage absorption. It's, it's just insane amounts. And also, Trance of Convalescence has the added bonus of uh, regening energy. <laughs> Pretty huge. All right, this is uh, th this is thirty kills. This has been a pretty uh, bad, <laughs> pretty bad farm. Also, a, a little distracted. I think we didn't we didn't focus a ton. I think after this we're gonna move on though. I do want to get to epic today. Okay, that's our that's our thirty kills, boys. A quick finish than Talos. Yeah, Talos, dude. If we honestly, I'm not kidding. If we got Talos and SBCs today on Epic, that actually Fine. would feel really the market good. market is busy again. Almost like honestly, busy. a cart nearly rammed into my stall. Can you believe? It? Yes. Bye. Yes. Bye. The best storage for our hero. Ta-ta! <laughs> Ta-ta! <laughs> Can you believe it? What is the the only other required quest is blacksmith and verger. Basically everything else don't need to do. Have you got my first? Yes, yes. Yeah, the uh, the verger history and blacksmith. That's about it. So this one here for two skill points. Anything else we don't need to do? Oh, shut up. Oh, shut up. No. Go, go, go. <laughs> I heard the go, go, go. Go, 
go, go! You have it! You're a hobbit. Not me. What is that? Trash oh. loot, man. Trash loot. Lupine Claws. Wait, why didn't why didn't who play? Don't we have who? Oh, it did play? I feel like you're trolling. <laughs> yeah, there it is. That didn't play. <laughs> that didn't play. The first time. Dude, this area coming up on X Max, the ambush before the door, I won't lie, is is pretty insane. Shh. Pretty insane. Affixes. Yeah, this this area with X Max is insane. So many mobs coming after you. Um, do we slam volatility? Let's see what else? I finished volley, right? Yeah. Good. Okay, so volatility and then probably bar for HP. Max is good too, yeah, that's true. I 
I don't know why I killed those. I don't need them. Another Master Forge. Oh no, that's Brenus. Look at that. We can actually wear this. My belly hungers for stew. Yeah, we can actually wear this. <laughs> she looks better with it on. Lose beers. Oh, okay. This gives us back. Uh, this gives us, gives us a lot more armor, right? Yeah. Shut the fuck up, Adios. I like this one better. It's 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 funny that that guy that guy like straight up had it equipped. That's pretty cool. It's one of those Titan Quest details that needs to come back. Dude, Titan Quest two monsters equipping their items. Oh man, yes please. Yeah, I don't want to lose the HP. It's true. I that's that that was really why I don't want to. 5k, 5k hit points feels nice. Another America vest. That's a farm right there. Where, where bracelet? Where amulet? It didn't fall through the ground. There it is. Oh wow! Do you guys remember my uh, <laughs> exclamation point rip? My corsair. <laughs> Let's just get the heron's gear. Get Heron's gear. It's dead, isn't it? Seventy-four percent pierce res on a shield. Huge. Jolem heart. We got a Jolem heart, boys. <laughs> okay, get me out of here. I'm not fighting these monsters that slow me down. That's toxic. Oops. 
Open up. Open up. Please, let me in. Let your sword rest. A human? Down here. <laughs> you look the worse for wear, Wanderer. You'd better buy some of our stock, or the fungoids will get you. Good luck. Are you going or staying? I haven't decided, okay, bud? Wow, of hunt. 125 armor. Everything else is worse. Oh, actually, movement speed better. Never mind. I don't want it. <laughs> Imagine thinking that the fungoids are able to kill anyone. Yep. The only thing the fungoids can do is put you to sleep. One, they're boring. Two, they can put you to sleep. Soup, soup, soup. I love mushrooms. <laughs> Same. Resist the urge. Resist the urge. Sleeping. Ah, wake me up. Give me orb. Oh, two. Bore with ham, please. Bore with ham. This is really reminding me of my Corsair now. Mythical Orb OP. Yep. Word. Word. Yo, two skill points. Oh yeah, my my kiss my my kiss kiss yeah kickal my kickal my kickal. My cock. <laughs> Fuck off. Amazing. Uh, bar. I know, I know we want eruption, but bar. Bar for 5k. Bar for 5k, Alex. Thank you. Amazing. Ha! Ha! Ah! Let me through. Don't reflect my balls. Don't reflect my balls. Why? Stop.
so much proc. So yeah. goddamn hard. Big damage. Oh, we got two eiders. Nice. That's a pretty good haul. Praise the sun. Watch out for the sun. Not so tough when you're not like the branch that reflects everything. All those monsters on the Yagrasral branch just reflect everything, and you can't hit them with the projectiles. Toxic. Toxic. Random Prometheus is here. Thank you. You again here? You again here? You again? You again? You again here? It's like a techno beat. Hmm? Constructs OP. Holy crap. I have no damage. Of horns. All kinds of horns. Cow Valkyrie boots. Hey, it can happen. My house is like barely standing. <laughs> the, wi the winds are blowing really, really strong here. It's insane. Taste my axe. 
Taste my axe! Taste my axe! <laughs> Over here! Over here! How did that miss? <laughs> How I know who's stealing my wins? I didn't know it was your turn. Titan Quest 2, please bring back goofy voice lines. Thank you. Where can I sign up to submit my goofy voice lines? Thank you. Yeah, lots of MIs, honestly. The Ragnarok MIs, but there are <laughs> lots of MIs. Kind of crazy. Old. I pulled far too many. Another MI. Yeah, more damage to plants. Wait, does he have a hat? He has a hat on. I think I think I want monster and frequency to be. Huh? I think I want fr monster and frequency to be. Um, um, 
more or less the same because we don't know how crafting is going to work if the, you know and what that's going to entail so the first kind of thing that popped in my head is like you know you could craft an affix on every item just like a just like a relic slot and like maybe a monster and frequent would have you know two slots or something like that something along those lines um or I don't want crafting potential like in Last Epoch, right? But, but maybe, maybe, um, yeah, maybe, maybe more of the same, but like, yeah, I don't know. I actually don't know. Now that I think about it, I don't know what I want with Monster and Frequence. I think I want them to be less, less frequent. If I don't want thousands and thousands of different types of monster and frequency, really I think I want a f instead of a full set of armor, right? I think I want like maybe one type from each monster, you know? I think a full set of armor from like, um, let's just say the, the, the Valhoil stuff. Every piece doesn't need to be a monster infrequent. That I think I think less amount of monster infrequents, the better. I don't know though. It, it's 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 complex on what I what I actually want. No! No! <laughs> no, no, no! Who's your epic mama? Naomi is a dog. What? It can't be. Loki. They can talk late. They can Who's talk your epic mama? You fool. Who's your epic mama? You fool. How do I pick that up? Yeah, SBC level, like, it's very valuable to get one, but, like, they're just not all over the place. Yeah. Well, that's kind of why I was, like, that's kind of why I was, like, saying reduce the amount that there are. Like, I like the idea of monster, monster armor. Don't get me wrong, but, like, welcome, welcome. every item slot from a you monster doesn't need to have a monster arms. infrequent, in I my opinion. Mind you, I've cracked a couple of your So like if you wanted to dress up as an Ichthian, that's fine, weapons, but only one slot might be a monster and frequent, right? Just as an example. Just click it, yeah. Just click it. I'm innocent. <laughs> no need to explain. No need to explain. Explain this. Explain this. Explain the horn. for the bridge. <laughs> That's why I used to imitate him because you just had you had no choice but to imitate like watch him do his yoga to open the, the bridge. 
You always get a bug? What's the bug? Where Santa Claus doesn't come up the ramp? Yeah, you gotta... You gotta, like, um... You gotta make sure you click on them after the uh, boss fight. Because otherwise, if you just let him do his voice, he won't leave the room. But that's why they put a fountain there, because they, they knew it bugged out. So you take a fountain at the top and you just reload the world. Ho, ho, ho. I hope, I hope Time Quest 2 is Whoa. full of community references. <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. I hope some idiot named Carl is like drunk in the bar. <laughs> That'd be awesome. That'd be, dude, that would be so cool. Oh, dude. <laughs> That'd be so cool. I'd laugh so hard. Dude, why am I fighting these things? My beer! Yeah, you have to reset Odin, yeah. Beer! <laughs> beer! Ow, ow, ow. Naomi's an ape. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Community references, you mean TQ ha devs half assing everything? Dude, it. Or like Sapros, the corruptor nerves, crying about the. Uh, Mjolnir nerves, like, dude, people are sad, man. People are sad in their hearts. People are sad. <laughs> you die, now. Now you die. People are sad. You mean the game I openly pirated? That only costs twenty dollars has has a singular bug that they supported from twenty years ago. I'm gonna I'm gonna pound on my keyboard with Cheeto dust and Dorito dust flying everywhere. Debs are bad. Let's <laughs> buy the game, man. Buy the game. It's five bucks. Five dollars. The boss killed me on Soul Vizier. Yo, dude. <laughs> yeah, mages are bad NPC. Yeah, 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 yeah. Everything I remember about Tiki community is crying about most random things or just, yeah, the, comp the devs only do it for the money. <laughs> dude. <laughs> yeah, it just makes me sad. Who's your epic mama? It just makes me sad. I, I, we, I know, Kaz. I know, I know Kaz. We, we, we went the other way. We know. Now we're dunking on the bad community. We're dunking on the community that says mages are bad. Yes, yes. A human! I can't get the Skyrim mod list to run. Do you have any idea what it is? Other people are gaming? Oh no. Why am I killing these things? We need to just run. We need to just run. Oh. <laughs> Oh, 
over here. <laughs> a human. A human. Um. Yeah, now we playing Skyrim. Idea says there's TQ community, Kerplunk community, uh, Fey community, human. Ice Freeze community. Uh, sorry. <laughs> Only two of those are good communities. Ice Freeze, Fey. Who's your epic mama? Amy says I get unresolved conflicts, missing file. Yo, get the files. <laughs> get the get the files. Damn. Uh, it's a shit show. Damn. Yeah, ice freeze. But yeah, I got my big Skyrim mod list running. Then I went back to playing more. <laughs> oh man. Bummer dudes. What about Klex plays? Who? Who? What's up guys, Kaplunk here. Today I'm gonna talk to you about... What should I talk to you guys about? What do you guys wanna talk about? Oh, I didn't have a kind What's bar. What's up guys here? Should I talk about kind bars? We can talk about kind bars. What's up guys, today I wanna to talk to you about Shut today's... Shut the fuck up, oh, I didn't get very far. I didn't get very far. Jeezy told me to shut up. God damn it! I'm actually very hard. Yo, look at all these. Look at all these boys. So, do we pull too many? Hard. Yes, Who's we your epic me? mama? Who's your epic mama? <laughs> mama! Oh, ah! no. oh. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Who's your epic mama? Will I play No Rest for the Wicked? Um, probably. Most likely. Ah, I'm, I'm, oh, my buffs were off. That's Who's why. Who's your epic mama? My buff was off. Oh, no, it's not. I turned it off. I turned it off. That was so random. <laughs> No, oh, he was excited. He was excited he didn't die. Everyone thought he was gonna die to Cyclops. Not everyone, but like... Like people said, hey, don't fight Cyclops, so... Immediately... You know, he should feel accomplished Who's by killing Cyclops. Mama? And he just got... Giga excited. Giga. The question I want to know is who y your epic mama is. Do we all have the Diesel. same epic mama? I think we all have the same epic, epic mama. What the?
<sighs> Grandma's bath water. <laughs> Audio, shut the fuck. Um, let's see here. I don't want this bow anymore. It's an amazing bow and I don't want it. Shut the fuck up, Adios. I don't want it. I want more attack speed. How do I get more attack speed? Just get it. Oh, actually, Primal Magma. SPC Primal Magma. Tinkerer. SPC Primal Magma. SPC Griffin. Or uh, SPC uh, Tinkerer. Log in. You know? Who's your epic mama? <laughs> I know I've said this a hundred times, but just the quality of the mic. I don't know why sometimes his mic sounds really bad, but like, dude, it's so good. Sometimes the low quality memes are the best. What am I doing here? What does it look like? I bet you didn't know that we Verger are respected for our craft in all nine realms. All nine realms. Don't get squashed. All right, little midget. Tyler won my best mic. <laughs> Tyler won head, best head. <laughs> it's a milk dud. <laughs> a little ch I I gotta stop. Who's your epic mama? Epic mama, best mic. Addicted and it can't quit. Is that uh, is that fix the game? <laughs> that clip's so good. <sighs> Wasn't it his wife or girlfriend or fiance that we did the cat video <laughs> tweet? <laughs> oh boy, live on stream we compared to a cat, grumpy cat. Did they actually buff cannon? Are they stupid? So instead of just being resistant to magic damage, they made it 70% both. They actually buffed banner. Are they... Buff banner, nerf 80 carry? Are you stupid? What are they doing? It's trash game. <laughs> Wait. Imminent implosion. Here it goes. They're hot fixing it? Nice! How did it even make it in live? How? Sweet, guys! They're hot fixing it! Cool! That's awesome and all! How did it even make it to live servers? How? How did they think that was okay to even put it in the game? I'm so sick of this fucking company. <laughs> the trash! It's the game! It sucks playing the shit! And I'm fucking addicted! So I can't quit! <laughs> I'm so sick of this shit! I'm done! I'm done streaming! I cannot stream this game anymore! <laughs> oh, it's so good. What's this one? Cat gif? What is this? <laughs> oh, 
What is this? And I'll see you guys again very, <laughs> very soon. Toxisodes. Toxis is <laughs> toxic, dude. <laughs> toxic toxisos. It doesn't even look like her. It's so mean. <laughs> it would be better if it looked like her. Oh, it's toxic. And I'll see you guys again very, very soon. Oh, uh, that's a good clip, though, Adios. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Resemblance is uncanny. I thought it was Quinn for a minute. Yeah, <laughs> it's just rage streamers. <laughs> okay, boys, we just run to the end. The only thing I will fight is Doppelganger right there. <laughs> Doppelganger. I got him. I got him. Me versus me. Who will win? <laughs> me. <laughs> nice job, gamers. The haw sound when hearing the command. Dude, they're gonna have to lock me away someday, and there will be no diagnosis for what I have. Cause of death, sound commands. Cause of laughter, sound commands. They're just in my brain. Oops, wrong way. There we are. Ah! There we are. <laughs> Poop yourself. Poop yourself, he said. He said the thing. He said the thing. Cocaino. What? What are you Prove doing? Prove yourself. Stop! <laughs> K. Carl Centrum, yeah. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, boys. It's the last part. The last part. Are you guys ready? Nope. Same. Not ready. I am not ready. Don't you die on server. I won't. I won't. I died to easy things like, uh... The Tyrant of Crete. What is he fighting? What was he fighting? Bark. Bark like a dinosaur. Where 
We're about to level up, boys. Is it a hot take to say the good part of Rag area ends after you finish Asgard? Uh, is there a good part of Rag? <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's toxic. Uh, bar. Surger Tower is cool. Yeah, it is. Yeah, that's true. That's cool. I have uh, 14 skill points. <clears throat> I mean, 14 attribute points. Scandia and Asgard. Yeah, Scandia is dope. Asgard's pretty cool. I don't like Hunenberg and Glauberg either. Like, the outside areas. The towns are interesting, but, like, it's just a bunch of just a bunch of morons in the wilderness butt-fucking at each other because they're druids. Like, what, what? what is this? Like, weird Neanderthal, like... Uh, yeah, I don't know. Not my cup of tea. Yeah. <laughs> I need pots. I think it's like too much weird uh, fuzzy green uh, texture for my for my taste in the early parts of Ragnarok. the druids I don't I don't care for I kind of I think it's interesting what they try to do with the lake but I don't care much for it honestly if I'm being honest it's kind of ass <laughs> fix the game but I can't quit because I'm addicted The lakes! We did it! Oh! The lakes! Demon's blood. Demon's blood. I need to stop killing these things. Although, actually, maybe I should get uh, maybe I should get um, primal magma. Hmm. Yeah, maybe I'll get primal magma. your epic mama who's your epic mama I don't think this is doing very much damage to them greetings traveler uh hello map Fuck 
Fuck you guys. Shut the fuck up, adios. Okay. okay. Excellent damage. Damn, my, my house is getting blown over. Holy crap. That wind is insane. 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 Yes. blood oh and we have uh, our legend our craftsmanship coming up yes yes Take the portal. Up here, tight. You really take the port, 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 take the portal. I. Hiya! Hiya! We did it. Yeah, real voice indeed. We did it! Brow! 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 Drow! 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 Take the portal! Take yeah, the yeah, portal! Will we get... Will we get Primal Magma? There's one. I don't actually know if I have another one. Brrrr! Oh wow, and we got flat health. Flat health, big. Yeah, we only have, literally only have one primal magma. Boo! Boo! Guys were shredding me in half. Boy, boy, do I me need um, what do you call it? Golden belt. We love the golden belt. Oh look, it's the shield. The shield. Oh, and it rolled recharge? What the? Nice. That's a pretty good roll. Magma. 
missed, uh, I missed the blacksmith. Blacksteel ingot. My God! <laughs> Who's your epic mama? Oh, holy shit! Holy shit! Okay, I gotta be honest with you. I didn't know my Who's buff was off. Who's your epic mama? I didn't know my buff was off. That was a bit close. I'm still alive, boys. That was a bit close. I almost cried for mama. Calculated, boys. We're doing it. Calculated. Less damage from giants? Who needs that? Just calculate your HP. Yeah, we did it. One more floor. One more floor. Your inventory is full. Oh, let me let me go turn this in. Let me actually turn this in. Dark lines. Uh, what is this? 15 HP. to find another axe or a sword or a bow or a bow am i gonna wear any of this no i may wear that all right what is this two hp calculated That's AI. That's fake. That's that. That's not real. That's that's not real. That's not real. You can't prove it. Good luck. Never forget dual wielding. Was this? Is it Rancor? Oh, ra oh, dual Rancor? Hold on. Wait, is it real? Oh, ra so hold on. Where's the man? Hold on. Go, go 50%. Hold on. You guys will be able to see it. 
There it is. Look. See? He's got two of them. He's got two of them. <laughs> okay, let's listen to this glorious sound effect. Oh, ra uh, dual rancor? Wait, is it real? Or is it just one? This is one. Oh, two! <laughs> Was that was that good? Was that good? It's two. It's two. Yo, Kerplunk. Yeah. <laughs> Yep, I sold both of them. Deleted them. <laughs> Never forget, dual wield though. Okay, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> dagger of baloney. <laughs> Who's your epic mama? <laughs> Ooh, big dagger, point pointy stab. Okay, we we did only have one. Oh no, we have two primal magnets. Good, excellent. Less farming. Oh, three primal magmas. Four Primal Magmas. Yes. Give me. Give. Give. Damn. We go again. I think we go again. Yeah. <laughs> Let me go get, let me, actually, maybe it drops down here. What if it drops down here? I'd be happy. Uh, does the dagger have no cooldown? I actually don't know. Uh, uh, it taking melee damage. Not sure if it has a cooldown, actually. Yeah, not sure if it has a cooldown. Primal magma. Give me magma. Give me magma. Okay, I am. I am gonna farm. I just need one more for my ep epic magma. Also, I need to stand up. I need to stand up. I've been sitting all day. Stand with me, brothers. Primal Magma. Primal Magma. Give. There it is. Nice. Nice. Only one reset. Excellent. Okay. Here's what you do. Wait, do we just put, do we just put it on bracers now? We could totally drop the the uh, the health. No, no, I don't want to do it yet. Here's what you do. You go to Sparta. Go to Sparta. Buy a cheap bracer. I'm busy enough supplying the Spartans. One thousand gold. Okay. Is there cheaper? Yes. <laughs> yeah. What? <laughs> There's 62, 62 gold saver. 
Good perfect. Night. Perfect. There's my attack speed. Go to bolt. Have your own artifact. Built to Recover order. charm. Done. Done. Thank you. <laughs> now it's time for Surter. It's time for Surter. Are you guys ready, boys? Boy, I'm ready. Hello, Surter. I have come to destroy you. Here we go, boys. I forgot, this might take a second because some of our damage is fired. This might take a second. Watch out for the meatball. <laughs> Meatball. Meatball. We did it! We did it! Oh, and, and the key! Wow, look at that! And the key! And as predicted, terrible loot. <laughs> terrible loot. But we did it. It doesn't matter. We did it. All right, boys. I suppose the time has come. Yours is a great deed here. I suppose the time has come. 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 I suppose the time has come for you to return. <laughs> All right, boys. Epic difficulty unlocked. Wait. Where's my credits? Where's the credits? Oh, I didn't take... <laughs> Who's your epic mama? <laughs> My credits. My credits. All right, l l who cares? L l let's see. Let's see how bad our resists are. Actually, vitality is going to be A-okay. I'll tell you that right now. It'll be fine. Look at this, boys. <laughs> We're capped on Vitres. <laughs> We we are 20, 20 vit res, at least twenty vit res over capped. Uh. <laughs> That's huge. All right, you guys know what to do. Save the horse. You save my horse. You save my You save my horse. <laughs> ah yes. Ah yes. Oh, I remember this village. No, no. <laughs> no, no, no. What you need here? We shall see you again, I hope. We shall see you again, I hope. A uh, good day to you. Let's do uh, just a ki just a kiss. 
of uh, inventory management. Just one kiss. Just one kiss. Um. Yep. 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 Oh, you know what? Maybe we go. Do we go four million Gamba real quick? Hold on. Let's go four million. Let's go Gamba. Sorry. Who's your epic mama? L let's Gamba. Just one. Just one. Just one. One last normal Gamba. That's that sounds fair, right? Who's your epic mama? <laughs> Uh, Atlantis, good deer. Who's your epic mama? All right, it's Gamba o'clock. No funny business. We're always open. Wow. Wow. Three items. We have sound bug. We have sound bug. It's the gauntlets. It's, it's crap. It's the gauntlets. It's all crap. Sleep and slow is the two set. That is trash. Uh, this, this dagger's pretty good, though. <laughs> we already have one. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Who's your epic mama? Okay. One other thing. One other order of business. The arcane arts are no more than remembering secrets that you once knew. Secrets that you once knew. Whoa, give me that back. What did I just sell? Huh? These? What did I just sell? What was here? Chill. Well, Mine. Well. Store your goods or ship them out. Mine. Um We were gonna do this. Smile on you. Hopefully I have enough. Artifacts. All formula accepted. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, we lost a little bit of health. Oh, just a kiss. Just a kiss of health. But... Big power. Percent fire, percent burn, flat fire. Big attack speed. It's huge. Use it. And abuse it. Oh, I know, I know why. I know why my health is weird. This had 20% reduction. <laughs> I was like, wait, that's way too low. <laughs> that's way too low. All right, let me get some sound. We'll play, we'll play some Epic for a little bit. Um. Yeah, give me one, give me one second, guys, while this loads. I'll be right back.
Epic time, baby. Epic time, baby. Who's your epic mama? <laughs> Ah, look at all this damage. Act 1 mobs versus Act 5 mobs. Always easier. Oh, I gotta do inventory real quick. Charm. Wow, Prometheus Flame. Big Flame. Good. Murdered real good. You defeat. I'm stuck. I'm fucking repair. stuck. Fuck my Stay life. Safe. Buy what you need here. Buy what you need here. Oh, of Glade. Wow. Wow. Until next time. A good day to you. Bing, 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 bing. Oh, oh, oops. Just 300 more dings, guys. Excellent. That's them all, right? Now it is. Now it is. <laughs> Here I keep you. If you've got to go out there, equip yourself properly. The slow leveling has started. I am blind. There's more? Your goods with me. Oh, here. Hermes guide you. Anything else? Thank you, Captain Backseat. Goodbye. Let's go, boys. Yeehaw. Let's go find tennis. Oh, look at look at that boy. He's got a spellbreaker, you dickhead. I swear I killed him before spellbreaker. What a dick. What a dick. Mastery Shrine, Mastery Shrine. Oh, speaking of, uh, Poison Res with Mastery Shrine is not still not quite capped, so that's something we'll have to keep in mind.
human face. A human face. For these creatures live like savages, fighting. You're saved, Tennis. Be free, my friend. Stone Hammer Farm, just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. Relax, right, just kidding. You did it actually the same way like he did. Oh, the... <laughs> the NPC? Oh! He's no... He's new? I can't do easy. He's untouchable. I know it's dangerous. Mastery Shrine. The necklace! Oh! Yo, we're about to hit 45. Bada bing, bada bing. Bada bing, bada bing. The necklace! Oh! <laughs> bada bing, bada bing. Battle marker. Holy smokes. A randomly silent level up. Thank you. Thank you. Gazel! Who's your epic mama? Do we get uh do we get a uh, ring of flame or uh fire wave? Fire nova? And now juice eruption? <laughs> Look at this, boys. Hey, uh, oh, pull them all. Wave. Oh. Okay. <laughs> it's not enough damage yet. <laughs> Soon. Soon it will be. But not yet. <laughs> ah, look at the fire. Look at the fire. I pulled too much. It's fine. It's fine.
Look at the burning. The fire damage. Oh my god, it's so good. Why did the demons steal his necklace? They were trying to get uh, his their daughter married too. It was a competition. Pristine bird plumage. Hold it there. I'm busy enough supplying the Spartans. Hurry, what do you want? Wow, Pegas Pegasus. Pegasus. Uh, do we need Ellie Res? Kinda. Kinda. How much damage do we lose? Not not a whole lot. Not a whole lot. Let's do that. Let's do that. Um, let Goodbye. me see if I have a boot. I can ease your load. Rip. Rip. Well, I suppose we go without uh, boot speed for now. Unless, unless this is cheap. Is it going to be cheap? I doubt it will be. What's the max level you can reach in normal before you have to go to epic? I don't know if the game ever makes you go to epic, but um... Um. Hmm. Good question. I don't actually know. Yeah, 300k. Rip. Apollo, watch over you. Rip the dream. What is it this time? Uh, you will stop getting meaningful XP though, so you basically you basically be in normal at like 50 before you before you really get me stop. You'll stop getting meaningful XP basically. Okay, was that enough? I didn't even notice. Is that enough? That should be enough. Okay. No regions, no artifact. Uh, these. Thank you. Come again. Perfect. Now we're not in the negatives at all. Perfect. Uh, now that I think of it, when you max out Eruption, Nymph Bow can be your main weapon until the end of the game. Eruption Fire deals like 10, pro 10 pro projectiles. Yeah, the, yeah, the, the Bow proc has no cooldown, which is po huge pog. Yeah, that thing is awesome. That thing is awesome. We just gotta get it now. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? If I look what? If I look worried. Mastery shrine. Oh, I was like, where's all my energy going? It's from, uh... Ring of Flame.
Look at all that fire. Any tips on summoner staff build? So, my first suggestion, let's see, let me make sure I tell you this right. My first suggestion is do not, under any circumstances, use a core dweller. <laughs> do not use core dweller. Um, I would have a healthy mix of... Um, Wraith Lord stuff, probably focus on elemental damages, right? Now, your wolves are going to be mostly physical damage, toxic, toxic, um, but adding, adding elemental damage to them is totally fine. Um, and if you don't do that, physical is the alternative. Either one of these is very strong. Probably physical might be slightly better, but completely up to you. Honestly, uh, the reason I say adding elemental is because you will actually scale your pet's damage with, um, with, um, earth enchantment. So that'll feel better, right? Um, next thing to think about is trying to get either Wraith Lords of Tinkerer, uh, Wraith Lords of Tinkerer. S some sort of ring, right? Uh, some sort of ring. And they get lots of resistance that way. Um, and then finally, finally, make sure you're using Earthbind a ton. Just use, it, use Earthbind a ton. It's big. Uh, and, and in terms of like stabs, I mean, really anything goes. Um, you could be you could be just a pure summoner and let your pets do all the work. You could get a staff that has lots of power for yourself. But because Earth Mastery has tons and tons of spells that you can cast, you don't even need to auto attack, in my opinion. Uh, in my opinion. So, um, okay, that those are just generic tips. If you have any like specific gearing questions, like. We can help you out. But, like, basically, I don't know if you're playing hardcore. I don't know if you're playing solo, solo self-found. Um, those are some generic stuff. If you want to go, if you want to go big survival, so, sorry, let me, let me actually show you this. Wraith Lord isn't actually the, the highest tier. The only reason I showed it was because you can get Wraith Lord Tinkerer, uh, whereas, whereas Allfather, uh, where at Allfather here. This is what you want on staff, amulet, and ring. If you're going to giga farm, uh, this is the highest tier. And then the suffix for for amulet, you can get convocation, right? 20% total damage, attack damage, converted health. You can get all father's convocation. Good luck, but I'm just saying you can get it. Um, yeah, that that's your top tier pet stuff. So... Uh, if you want to play with Cordweller, I I should I should back up. Cordweller is totally fine. He just he requires a lot of pe uh, points, and so what I'm talking about get, picking him up. You're playing with plus to skills. You're in the level 70s, right? Um, and you have almost everything else kind of high pointed already. That's when you can transition into him. He does provide interesting like attack options for mobs and he taunts off your pets pretty well but he doesn't taunt off of you very well um so just think about those things there's there's almost 
almost any staff that you might think is good is good for a mage. Um, if you're trying to get pet staves, uh, what I would recommend is going to the staff tab and doing, um, I think, I think you can do pet, right? You can just do pet. And so like, does this not work? Ooh, there we are. Does it not work like that? I, there's a way you could search for pet stuff. Hold on. Uh, where's the one pet staff? Where's the one pet staff? Hold. Please hold. Oh, it's, it is epic. Whoops. Uh, sum, summoners. No, what's the, what's the, is it the druid one? Hold on. What's the staff that has plus the skills? Or is this, is this where you have to control F? Hold on. Yeah, control F does not work. Hold on, there is a staff I was going to, there's a blue staff that I was going to recommend to you. I can't remember what it's called. Where the hell is it? Yep, so it's it it's listed like this. Yeah, why does that not work? That doesn't work. So if you go, hold on, staffs, and you hit control F, if you type that in, okay, now it works. <laughs> oh, it, literally one out of one. This website is is dog water. <laughs> it's dog water. But anyways, any pet that has any staff that has the yeah, here it is, Druid's literally Druid staff. What the hell? So, so since I said, since I was saying before that you, you don't need to auto attack, um, this has a, a higher tier pet damage roll on it than most, most stabs. The problem with limiting yourself to a druid staff is there are, you could, you could just get an all father's staff, uh, and a non unique, but this one is, this is like mid game. You can get this fairly easily. So. Uh, I don't know if this was helpful. Hopefully it was. But just definitely take take an advantage of um, using the database and just looking at items. Um, that's what I would recommend. Mage bad, yeah. So will the wolves only build be enough to get through epic and legendary? I think they start to be pretty weak by the end of normal. Uh, yeah, well, you have to you have to like keep up the damage, right? You have to. You have to take advantage of plague. This here, minus forty percent physical resistance. If you don't take that, then yeah, you know you're you're not you know shredding their resistance. Um, you need you need to max the base out ASAP. Uh, you only have to one point maul, really. Uh, you only have to one point survival instinct, but this needs to be maxed. When they shout, they get total speed and they get sixty eight percent physical damage. Um, and as long as you're as long as you keep adding on all all five slots plus a sixth, if if possible, which would be your artifact. Um, as long as you're adding pet damage there, they will murder. They will absolutely murder. Um, and then also when you get here, Earthbind, you only really need to one point it. What Earthbind does, it will immobilize mobs and reduce their defensive ability by 50%. And because defensive ability um, garners against melee attacking, right? 
your wolves melee attack. So if a mob has less defensive ability, there's less chance for them to miss and increased chance for them to crit. So it is it is a damage increase no matter how you look at it. Um, and then finally, the rotation is kind of this. Uh, put out a plague, do an earth bind, refresh, do that again, right? So you just, you're kind of just resetting cooldowns with that. That's kind of the, the rotation. Uh, another thing to look at is like when you're fighting bosses, get used to min-maxing your wolves inside your sanctuary. This sanctuary here during boss battles or hard encounters, you put down your branches, they have a little bit of taunting, they have like nice whatever distraction but inside sanctuary uh well if as long as you spec into this this has 24 percent damage absorption so as long as you're standing in there um or getting your wolves in there that kind of thing so that's kind of the rotation that's kind of how you take advantage of it and then also i mean i don't even need to explain how good heart of oak is as long as you're near your pets they get total speed they get 65 percent health they also get elemental resist, right? It's just good stuff. So if you're not supporting them as much as you possibly can, yes, they're weak. <laughs> they are weak. <laughs> so that's, and that's usually the problem. People love pets, but they don't support them. Um, yeah, so. Okay. Hopefully that helps a little bit. Yeah, you could also. There, this is another thing. I'm sorry, I'm rambling. This is, I suppose, a learning opportunity for just anyone, really. Um, but if you go scrolls, uh, this here whatever difficulty you're on, whatever, whatever. So it's like, this is a normal one. The reason this is cool, it does, this does not have anything to do with pets, but if you enjoy summons, this is a, this is a scroll that I heavily recommend uh, purchasing. They get a little expensive, but what happens is you summon three harpies. I mean, uh, two harpies. And the, the cool thing is, is they have squall, right? They come with squall. Um, in addition, their lifetime is 180 seconds. That's exactly the length of the cooldown of the scroll. So basically, if you buy a couple of them, they'll last as long as their cooldown. So you can have them up 100% of the time if you're going to go that route. So just, just things to think about. Am I going to play a summoner in the near future? Uh, I don't think I have a summoner on the list, but... But I did have a hermit playthrough recently. If you're on my second YouTube channel... Because I don't think I streamed on YouTube yet. Uh, but my second YouTube channel has should have all my past pods. Um, I played with a hermit, and a hermit has lots and lots of pets. So... It's a little different because it's summoner versus uh, hermit, and I went strength. I think in the beginning I leveled as intelligence, though, so. Wor worth a check. Cordweller leveling soon. Okay, yo, we'll, we'll make it work. I'll just highlight why I don't like it. Yeah, we'll make it work, though. Cordweller's not bad. It's just like, it's a, it's a level, it's a question of efficiency. Same thing with like, same thing with like dream image. It's not bad. It's just better things, you know. Now, if we're talking about monster lure, okay, it's always bad. I hate it. <laughs> yeah, squall, squall equals win. Yeah, it's. Tr I mean, it's true, man. You mean a summons that has squall? Like, what the hell? I mean, no matter what I play, I can have squall. <laughs> That's awesome.
Uh, I also have, um... I don't know if you've seen them, but I also have... Oh, I'm getting attacked. Hold on. I also have some quick start guides on YouTube. The nature one is particularly focused on pets. So that'll just kind of talk about what basically what I just brought up. But if, if you're interested in pets, the more you play with them, the more you'll the more you'll kind of figure them out, honestly. I do quite like pet builds because it's like if you want to get good at pet builds, you you kind of have to build that mechanical uh you know, kind of mechanical challenge of like min-maxing where your pets go, pulling them back, you know, that kind of stuff. Uh, in my opinion, what are the worst skills in each mastery to level with? Uh, anything but Squall. <laughs> Squall's the best. Um, we could just go like this. We can go... Starting with Spirit. Um, Life Drain is close. To, to as good as uh, Summon Lich. And the worst skill to level with is turning an attack early. Okay? So that's kind of taken care of because you can't really level with anything else in this in this mastery. You can't really. Lich King, in my opinion, is probably the best. We're talking early. We're talking about early game. Right? Uh, act 1, Act 2. Uh, Life Drain becomes very, very good. But you, ha you just have to focus on it. And so that's why the base of Lich, he'll just carry. So these two are very, very good. Turning in is bad until Act 3, roughly. Okay, so that kind of takes care of uh, spirit. Uh, Nate and mastery, the worst skill, uh, in my opinion, I'm not saying you can't do it, and I'm not saying people don't do it, is Huang Di's favor. It, it becomes very powerful up here, which is all the way at the top of the bar. Um, the best skill to level with is Shen Pao. However, because it's slightly high in the bar, um, Breath attack takes takes a precedent in my opinion for Act One and maybe part of Act Two, but yeah, basically all of Act One, you start with uh, breath attack and then you transition into Shen Pao. This this will literally carry you through, you know, Act Three and Four. I mean, you'll have other abilities to go with it, but um, next we got oh sorry, what did I do? Spirit oh sorry, Spirit. Let's do Nature. Um, wolves top tier worse worse ever to level with plague. There's nothing else in here you can level with. You could argue Sylvan Nymph is a level, but it's too low. So wolves and nymph top tier plague worse bottom. Don't do it. Uh, rogue poison gas bomb S tier. Um, just weapon attacks is also kind of like A tier. Um, leveling, uh, this is low level throwing knives is also like maybe B tier. So it would technically be the worst. And then traps is kind of like somewhere in between auto attacks. And this is er but again, early game. Um, the worst to level with is probably throwing knives, uh, in my opinion, low level. Uh, they come online pr pretty quickly. Um, but I just poison gas bomb top tier. <laughs> top tier uh hunting marksmanship i hate it i just hate it uh but i think leveling with ensnare is way way worse because the thing with marksmanship is it actually adds damage the more points um this does too technically but it has so many uh, so many resistances um another bottom tier choice is if you're only leveling with takedown uh, it's a it's a good gap closer it is not a good leveling skill so takeaway here is the worst skill to level with is barbed netting and uh, ensnare. Don't do it. It's bad. It's terrible. Uh, storm. Okay. Do I need to talk about this? So S tier is Squall. Level with Squall. Um, A tier is auto attacks. Right? Auto attacks with your 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 buff. 
And then the only other option is um, Thunderball. This is this is the worst skill. Ice Shards is also very, very good to level with, but it's not quite top tier. It's probably, top, in my opinion, it's probably topped or it's tied with uh, Storm Nimbus. Because The reason Storm Nimbus is very good is because what you do is you just buff your weapon and then focus on uh, attack speed. So if you, can, if you get lucky and you get really big attack speed early on, um, I think it kind of outpaces ice shards but it depends so there's no clear winner because it's kind of depending on rng the worst leveling skill is focusing solely on thunderball don't do it <laughs> don't do it uh earth mastery ring of flame top tier um auto attacks slightly below that and then flame surge is the worst but it's not by far because leveling you don't run into fire immunities oh i forgot a volcanic volcanic orb is above auto attacks but not quite as high as ring of flame this volcanic orb is quite strong this when if you focus just on volcanic orb and get a little bit of recharge uh it'll carry it as as the only skill through act three not even kidding so um yeah the worst i think is flame surge uh but it's it's not horrible defense the worst to level with well it's hard to answer that. <laughs> it's hard to answer that because you don't have that many options. You have two options, technically. You have uh, batter and you have shield charge. That's it. <laughs> They're equal. <laughs> They're equal. Actually, batter is really good. If you focus only on shield charge, you're just doing it wrong. Um, warfare, banner OP, you guys know. Um, I'm going to say it. I'm going to say it. Uh, onslaught is probably the worst to level with. I'm talking about Act One. You put it in Act One. I salute. I salute you. You you got some. Uh, you got some balls. Um, uh, okay, so bat battle standard OP. Um, Warwind. If you focused on just Warwind and uh, Lacerate, it's pretty good, but it's got a long cooldown. Um, okay, so. We, we kind of covered warfare like that warfare is a hard one to do technically dream distortion wave op um phantom strike is pretty good but it takes a lot of points and it has a long cooldown um distort reality is really good psionic touch i think i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna say it is worse than distortion wave very clearly so technically since your answer, your question was, what is the worst leveling skills? I would say psionic touch, but don't misunderstand. I'm not saying it's bad and I'm not saying it's hard. You know, you can't use it. I'm just saying it's like technically not smooth and not as good as distortion wave. Just saying some of these are hard to answer, to be honest with you. So, um, rune mastery. Uh, I, I'm also, this one's hard. I'm also going to say it the best. The best leveling, the best leveling in my opinion, or mines, so much AoE. Absolutely insane amounts of AoE. The worst leveling um, is not auto attacks. The rune weapon plus magical charge is great. Uh, it's probably equal, maybe even better than runic mines. Maybe. So it's tied for not bad, right? I think the worst leveling skill would be Thunderstrike. It's good, but if you only focus on Thunderstrike, you're doing it wrong, you know? Okay, so that one's that one's done. Uh, what else do we do? Do we get everything? Is that everything? Yeah, we did Nadan already, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Clip it and ship it. Clip it and ship it. There you go. <sighs> Worst lovely skills, men here's wall. Okay, top, t uh, bottom tier, men here's wall. Don't do it. I can't seal of fate. <laughs> okay, you guys, it's hard to answer. It's hard to like kind of talk about what a leveling skill might be. But you guys, you guys get it, at least a little bit, right? Also, I, I'm, I, I'll gladly be proven wrong because, uh, you know, numbers are kind of hard. But that's just my, that's just my kind of, kind of quick take.
Okay, I'm missing a buff. I knew something felt funny. Uh, any skill that makes you... Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, that's what I was going to say. Like, just because there's something I said that might be the worst leveling skill... You know, that's that's a little clickbaity, you know? Titan Quest is, should be about having fun, and if you want to min-max, you can. Absolutely. But I recommend fun first. It, it's really, especially starting out in Titan Quest, it's really hard because, like, there's so much to try. Like, so much to try. Okay, Diablo has, what, five classes? Diablo, Diablo has maybe one good ability in each class, right? That's nothing to try. Try, like, five billion mastery combinations. F try, you know, roughly ten weapon combinations. You know, ten different weapon types supported by every mastery. Yeah, it's just crazy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I learned. I thought Onslaught was the best skill, and then I learned. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's so clickbait, dude. Oh my god. Z Zoomer brains. <laughs> it sucks, though, because, like, you have to, like, hype something up. You have to get, like, you have to get clicks some kind of way. Because otherwise, nobody watches a, nobody watches a video, but man. That shit's annoying. Even play can be lo yeah, it, it can. It's 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 not good, <laughs> but you can totally level with it. <laughs> Even remove thumbnails? Yeah. Guys, we got big distracted today. There's no way, there's no way we were gonna get uh, as far as I wanted to. Got massively distracted, I'm sorry boys. But it is time for Boar Snatcher. It is time. War Snatcher, where are you? Time to die. He dead. He dead. Hello, wait, wait. Uh, oh yeah, you did, yeah, yeah, I just didn't see it, I just didn't see it, yeah, I went through, you're on the list, it'll be a while, <laughs> it'll be a while, there's eight, there's nine in the queue, <laughs> I used to sell plows and sides insane, to farmers, but summoner monsters, incoming, in and ten years, trees and spears, Wow. Smiting band. I did not mean to autocomplete that rip. I thought this was cool, but then I learned this. There's an extension that replaces video titles with more descriptive titles. Oh damn, that that's actually really cool. That's like if you're if you're like trying to really learn from YouTube. Right, because most a lot of people just use YouTube as like 
a little bit of entertainment, a little bit of learning. But if you're like, if you're like logging into YouTube and you're like, I'm about to learn some skills. Please tell me if this video gives me the skills. Yeah, that, that's pretty handy. I like that. What's it called? S something like n no bullshit titles on YouTube. Artemis Guide. I must moo. What? You type that and hit enter. I must moo. What? Mortal. Mortal. I'm trapped. I, I, it's okay. I just, you know, I wouldn't worry about it, honestly. New dishes cooked by Redfire. Yo, what are, what are you feeding, uh, feeding us, Redfire? Did you bring enough for the whole class? That's a lot of fire. Okay, boys. What are the best? If you if you have Grim Dawn installed, you have it's the worst the leveling clean. skill. If you don't have it installed, it's the best leveling skill. And clean again. Uh, bye, Rob. Hello. I know significantly less about leveling in Grim Dawn. To be completely honest with you. And if I make a tier list, it'll get clipped and shipped to uh, to Protoss, and he'll dunk on me live on stream. Well, know how I know. Oh wow, flat fire damage plus health. Ooh, I'm just kidding. I I honestly don't think I could uh, finish that tier list in 20 minutes because you could level with so much and get done. In my opinion. Bye. Farewell. Farewell. Bye, Aphrodite. Uh, it's called D Arrow Better Titles. Nice. Thank you, audience. By Afro. Oh, you're saying you're saying bye. <laughs> Guys, I'm tired. It's been a, it's been a day. All right, don't reflect yourself to death. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Nice job, gamers. We didn't reflect ourselves to death. You guys remember the I remember the rogue leveling guide. Do you remember poison gas bomb? I because I do. One bomb, one dead rogue. But YouTube didn't know that. 
He had to be here live. Sponsor block. Oh, nice. Yep. Yep. Like the mid-roll sections and stuff. That's pretty cool. Oh no, <laughs> I lost a charm. I lost a charm. Boo. Damn, you guys, you, I was really hoping we could get SPCs today. That took way too long. I got distracted. I'm sorry, I let you down. Yo, big that means that just means big power on Monday. Listen, big power. Like absolutely massive power. It's kind of good that we're not stuck farming at the end of the stream. It's always it always feels good to farm at the beginning of the stream, I think. Or at least like not at the tail end. Oh, you know what that means though? You know what we can we can get we get better charms. Oh man, going to epic is so good. Oh, it's so good. Oh, we get bigger and valor of anchovies. Oh man. Well, I just get especially especially on the weekends, I have to conserve my energy cuz like that's usually when I do most of my work. And I did not conserve any energy today. I am very tired and I have to go straight from here to... It doesn't matter, but I have to go to work and it's like... I'm tired. <laughs> I didn't sleep enough, got up too early, did work in the morning, streamed all day, got distracted all day. Now, it's, now I gotta go to work. But... Epic is... I mean, Epic has been started. That does feel good. That feels good. We have been avenged. Roll the horn, use your abilities. Honk, 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 honk. Dude, what if we had bow, bow of horn? So staff of Karnax is a physical staff. What if we have bow that was like elemental based? Right? And it just honked. <laughs> just shout out the horn the whole time. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Well, I gotta answer this. Yeah, the honker. Yeah, there you go. Honk, honk. Oh, summoners. Oh, oh, oh. The pet enjoyers in chat. Look, we just got a summoners loop. Yeah. Two arms. 
and two legs. Warrior. We've got troubles. Every time. I need a bag here. Every time. Fourth Monsters bag, please. Right, There's plenty of room. Not just in Sword and shield, not your style? I think you'll find what you're looking Warrior. for here. Warrior. Warrior. Oops, what was that? Goodbye. Welcome, welcome. A fine warrior like yourself. I'm sure I'm I've sure. Got just what you're looking for. Oh, wow. <laughs> dude, dude, we could get a way better bow. A <laughs> hundred points of damage. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, my gosh, man. It's time for a new bow, man. Holy crap. Nothing else? The truth is... Everyone's talking Hold about Lucius. Hold the Lucius. We're gonna get a new bow from Talos on Monday. Monday, bright and early. If you're not there, that's okay. I will be here. Bright and early on Monday. Mm -mm -mm. I can't wait. Oh yeah, there's the commands list. It's not exactly up to date. I'll get you started. Hello, Igor. Hello, gamer. Repair shop continues to replace uh, 200 RTX 4090 power connectors every month. Woo! That's a lot. That is a lot. Photos of burn connectors, yeah. Yeah. Not doing so good. Not doing so good. That's more than two, right? Uh huh. Couple. Wait, how did I lose? How did I lose? Oh, uh, that's right. I forgot. I put attack speed on my bracers and I lost 10% health. It's okay. I'll get it back. Speaking of. I could actually spend some points here. Let's do that. Uh, let me go to town real quick. Hold. Please. That's all they welcome. Hold. Uh, Two hundred ninety-four decks. Three hundred decks. Yeah. So we need we need a lot more decks. So we've been going. Two to one. So we'll do that. Cool. Okay, so what I was gonna try to do in Ragnarok was get the um Sakelis's leg guards or uh Thyphi's leg guards. Those are actually really good boots. But we could get them from Talos when we farm on Monday. And that's a dexterity scaler, by the way.
Uh, imagine producing insane level GPUs and using shitty connectors and stuff. Well, I mean, this is this is what I think about is like um, most most people. Th this is a hot take, I think. If you spend money, lots of money on bleeding edge tech, and then have to replace the connector, you're uh, you've already spent bleeding bleeding edge money. It would feel even. Imagine what it would feel like to to buy a, a low end card and like it be really bad. Because that feels bad if you're already in the need. But high, but people that think they need the high end stuff, they have the money to throw away or burn. I'm not saying they deserve it. I'm just saying like uh, it's different. It's different. Uh, should Nvidia care? I don't know. That's up to you guys. Right? It's not gonna. I mean. It's not gonna change anything. But I guess I guess my point is you know it, it, that creates business for a repair shop, which is good for that repair shop. You know? Is that best practices? No. Of course not. Of course not. Yes, yeah, just think outside of the GPU box, you know? People are buying their Bye. products like crazy and NVIDIA is getting plenty of money. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure NVIDIA doesn't hardly make any money right now off of consumer GPUs and they haven't for a while. I mean, they don't operate at a loss, I don't think, but they're making all their money from uh, you know, their Tensor cores and their AI cores and stuff. Like, that's where their business is. So, they, they it's true to say that they probably don't care about <laughs> GPUs. But generally speaking, they don't care. Uh, see you, Extreme. Have a good night. Have a good weekend. They were told that and literally said it's not Nvidia's problem and they never cared to fix it and claim that you should not. So the problem the problem right now that it sounds like Nvidia doesn't care, which they don't, is for a while they got rid of um they got rid of the Founders Edition stuff. And so what I remember, this is this is just generally I'm just trying to like recount what I think is happening, is like they got rid of the Founders Edition stuff. And so the, now all they have is like um, these partner cards, and they really screwed their partner manufacturers over. And so they, the Nvidia, put the the that connection repair cost on the partners, like Asus and just whatever other brand, right? Gigabyte. I don't know if they make GPUs anymore, but uh, yeah, Gigabyte does. But so so it's up to Gigabyte. It's up to Asus. It's not up to Nvidia, which is real shitty. But like. You know, at, I, at least they manufactured the board, and so I get it. It would be up to Asus. Um, and that's why NVIDIA wanted to get out of um, manufacturing the full-on board, because they wanted to, like, shift around those costs, which is also shitty. I mean, it's also business. But the way they did it, sound, from what I remember, sounded shitty as well. But I mean, I agree with the audience. They're just, it's business to save money and like comes off definitely really shitty because it is, but. I think only, only recently, only the recent couple of, last, last couple of years, NVIDIA finally has cons like, consumer consumer um like competition uh soon battle mage from uh intel sounds like it's going to actually be pretty good it's the arc uh, 2.0 whatever whatever you call it it's the next generation of arc guards called battle mage sounds like it's going to be pretty good so in the consumer marketplace nvidia at uh, radeon they're all going to be Competing. I don't know what price points Battle Mage is fighting at, but it all sounds pretty good.
but for a long time, NVIDIA hasn't had any competition, any, in the, um, the uh, more in, um, non-consumer marketplace. So that's why they just, they just do whatever they want, basically. Yeah, it's like, it's that kind of, like, fakeness, which is probably not true. You know, they're, pro they're probably still going to do GPUs, obviously, but... No, we did it! We did it! Cheers for another excellent stream, and cheers to the chat for great company. Thank you, Susie. Happy Goodbye. Friday. Goodbye, Susie. So the skeletons will... Please, have a look. Well, it is almost quitting time, huh? How about we go kill Spider? And, uh, I think... I think that will probably do it. My pleasure. You strike me as a bow and arrow sort. <laughs> Bow and arrow. Bow and arrow. Satisfaction guaranteed. Guaranteed. Bow and arrows. <laughs> there it is. I'll tell. I also heard. Uh, this is the back with the tech talk. Sorry, I'm just rambling. Uh, sorry, old man, tired rambling. Um, for a while, but last two generations, um, Xbox and PlayStation has signed exclusively with Team Red, you know, Radeon, as their internal graphics. I think, I think Microsoft, well, there's lots of rumors that they're not going to do another console uh, after the refresh. Who knows about that? But they have not signed or extended what they're going to, like, extended their contract. And so I think, I think Intel was edging in on PlayStation's next hardware. So all the shakeup is good. It's all good. So that means if, if Radeon loses business My somewhere, God. they have to try harder <laughs> in another area. Hopefully they don't even, they're, they're doing fine in the consumer area. I just mean like shaking up uh, deals is, is always good. I think for the consumer. That'll be quite interesting to see, in my opinion. Next couple, you know, upgrade cycles. Seems pretty exciting. Yo, look at these turtles! Twile. Look at these turtles! Look at these turtles! AMD is doing great things because they're aiming to please as many people as possible in any way possible. Yeah, I, I, the open, open source, um, you know, DLSS competition. I think so. Intel's tech, uh, super sampling is called XESS, which is actually pretty good. And then AMD's version of DLSS, which hasn't quite released yet. So like the open there, so there's FSR which is not the neural network trained the neural trained um, super sampling or uh, super resolution, you know what I'm saying? Um, they talked about it in March and I don't remember when it's coming out, but just the fact that it's open source and you can run if you have an Nvidia piece of hardware, you can run uh, eight, um, AMD's su you know super sampling. I think that's great. Um, the problem is, is they always come after NVIDIA. They all, NVIDIA has the money to just piss away and like beat them to the punch. Um, but it's a decent dichotomy with like, okay, this is what's popular. Here, we'll do this, but cheaper or open source. I think that formula is really interesting. Um, they've never been, um, 
I shouldn't say never, but they haven't really beat NVIDIA to, you know, the actual innovation line. They've just always been like, well, I see what you're doing, but we'll do it better, cheaper, and open source. Like they, I think that's an interesting formula, in my opinion. Yeah, that's a fair way to put it, right? The beasts have claws and teeth, but you have fire. You have Zeus-like bolts to throw. Oh yeah, ja Jaguar Claw. I, I didn't even look at this. We got, uh, what it roll? Poison damage? This thing actually could be an upgrade. Hold on. So we've got 714 points of damage. Hold on. Don't judge. Yeah. <laughs> it's a huge upgrade. Uh, ah, it's huge. <laughs> we could go back to, we could go, <laughs> I don't even have a charm on here. <laughs> uh, that's insane. <laughs> that is insane. We're going to use that for a while. That is absolutely bonkers, boys. This is what the dan- Okay, I have battle marker, so that's like a little cheating, but... <laughs> it's because of the bleed and the poison, yeah, which never really ticks, essentially, if they die in two hits, you know? It's, it's, it's differently good. Excellent damage. What is our attack speed, by the way? Uh, we got to be close to cap, right? Oh, one four. Oh wait. Um, yeah, one seventy nine. It's pretty good. Wait, can we kill with eruption? We can. Okay, I'm just gonna chase her. <laughs> Who cares about cheese? Achilles that shit? Yeah, I will. I will. Is it, is, do, I, do I have it sped up? No, it's just... um. I just have a lot of attack speed. And probably movement speed for that matter. We're gonna get even more juice on Monday because plus to skills. Oh yes. My bow. My bow. Uh, I don't actually have an epic one started, right? Yeah, I did not get an epic. 
And I don't think I have a spare Valor of Achilles. So on here, we have a Bowstring and a Valor of Achilles. Oops, I just burned down the village. So probably what we'll do is just farm a Valor of Achilles next week. A blacksmith of That's probably what we'll do. I was on. I see you've traveled a long road, stranger. Come have a look. Come have a look. I might have something to suit your needs. Wow. What? What? Eighteen percent total speed. <laughs> wow. 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 We will. A shield. <laughs> oh, split res plus health. Split res plus health. Big. Sell it. Farewell. Damn, we're about to hit 46. Sheesh. I heard a charm. I have to go back. Gosh, why? <laughs> Charm alarm. Um, there's some people, there's some Scottish people that can he say purple burglar alarm. Yep. Yep. If you know, you know. Just insta click. Just up the road from Clan by the push wing. Just, just, just insta click. Go, go, go. <laughs> um, there's some Scottish people that kind of say purple burger alarm. Purple burger alarm. Purple burger alarm. Ah! Purple burger alarm. Purple burger alarm. Burger. 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 Purple burger alarm. Burger. Burger. Um, there's some Scottish people that kind of say purple. Tennessee. You mean like the state Tennessee? People that kind of say purple. Some Scottish people that kind of say purple. Purple. Some Scottish people that kind of say purple burger alarm. Purple burger alarm. Purple burger alarm. <laughs> oh, it's so good. It's such a good clip. She did. She did. Wow. Molten loop. Molten loop. Come closer. Come closer. Dude. <laughs> Molten loop OP. <laughs> Tennessee. I'm, I'll, I'll keep that. We'll, we'll play with that next week, if you know what I mean. No box. Sad box. Okay, boys. Uh, that's going to be it. Look, we killed Spider. We didn't go quite as far as I wanted to. It's after five. I need to be done. I need to be done. Boys. And purple burglar alarms. Thank, Thank you very much for hanging out. Have a good Friday. Have a good weekend. Goodbye. I will see you guys bright and early Monday. Thank you, but goodbye. Big power on Monday. Uh, Talos Farm. 
Stonebinder's Thank cuts. You, but we grind through Act Two. We grind through Act Three. Probably a uh, uh, What's his name? Shut Typhoon Farm. Big. Yo, guys, thanks for hanging out. I, I will see you next week. Have a good weekend. Bye. Fuck you guys.